Oh, I'm here. Hi, everybody. Happy Extra Sunday Stream. You're the only Twitch streamer I watch regularly. Thank you for the hours and hours of entertainment. Aww. And the enjoyment of any and all things Persona. Oh, that's really sweet. That's too sweet, actually. That's illegal. <laughs> oh god, wrong screen. Hold on. Yeah, you don't want to watch the game like that. You want to watch the game like this. Yeah, you do. Hi, everybody. Welcome. How's everybody doing today? Happy Sunday! Whoa! <laughs> We're here. I'm alive. Uh, bonus stream today because, uh, as I mentioned before, I'm going on vacation starting on Thursday. So there's no Thursday, there's no Friday stream, there's no Monday or Tuesday stream the following week. So that's four days of no regular stream. So I'm trying to make it up with like extra weekends. And that goes for, um, and that goes for this weekend and next weekend. I'll try to try to do that, but yeah. Oh, I'm famous now. Yes, I was. I, I don't know how to, he says it in his video. How do I say his name? Saffrilis, Saffrilis, Saffrilis Productions? Yeah. <laughs> I butchered the name. I'm so sorry. <laughs> but, um, but yeah. Uh, that collab video that he did That was for his like 1 million uh, Subscribers on YouTube celebration. It was really cool to be a part of it Yeah, I also love your outfit today Chris Hall. Don't thank you. We, we chill today. We chill Got, We I keep it we keep it simple here. Chill, chill But um, but yeah, uh I know a couple people have been uh, been bugging me about that But yeah, he finally put out the video he he started working on that video like four or five months ago. It's insane. He's been working on that for a very long time. But I actually just finished watching the entire hour and a half video this morning. So uh, that was it was really it was a joy to see the whole production because damn, he's uh, he's definitely good at what he does. It was really it was it turned out to be a really, really, really cool video. But yeah. I was definitely really honored to be a part of it. He messaged me for my part three months ago. <laughs> it was it was a long time ago. I was wearing a sweater in my in my portion of the video. It was it was cold then. That was like four months ago. So yeah, cool stuff, cool stuff. And it was a uh, Shafferless Productions video. I I don't know how to pronounce the name. I know I've heard it many times pronounced right, but uh. Here, I'll put a link in the chat for anybody that wants to check it out. He collabed with a lot of YouTubers for this. Like, I was definitely not the only one. There was a lot, a lot of YouTubers involved in this. I was very honored that he approached me. Uh, there we go. I'll just spam the link. That's the video. Go check it out. It's definitely a really good watch. Um, but anyway. I'm, I, I am enjoying all of, like, the collabs I'm doing. <laughs> I've been, um... I've been collabing with a lot of YouTubers lately, and I hope I can keep doing more because honestly, it's really, really fun. I feel like I'm uh, making friends by collabing in a way. It's really, really fun. Shay Frillis? I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. But anyway, although the music is not on, give me a second. There we go. Now you should be able to hear it. Okay, but yeah, I'm sorry that today is gonna be a shorter stream. Uh, we literally only just planned a family dinner uh, 30 minutes ago. <laughs> We're like, sure, we can do this, but that just means my my stream is gonna be cut short today, unfortunately. But um, yeah, so I have to leave in about three and a half hours. So yeah, it's gonna be a little bit shorter. I'm really sorry. I just wanted to put out a stream regardless. But I also have a present to show you guys. Oh, you didn't think, even though this is a three and a half hour stream, I have a present for you all. Yeah? All right. Take a, take a look. Take a look on this screen for a second. We're gonna look at these personas. Okay. Take, take a look at what we got. The unicorn. Got him. Got him. We got we got unicorn, the most important persona in every game, the persona that carries every game. 
Unicorn is here and ready for action. Not only is this a regular unicorn, no, it's not just a regular unicorn. It's a unicorn with fucking Megado. Uh-huh. This unicorn is about to fuck shit up. It's gonna murder. Unicorn with an almighty attack? Oh ho ho! Now, this whole game is done. I, I can basically beat the entire game with just this single persona. So that's my- that's- <laughs> That's where we're at today. Hold on, I can't get my lighting to look good today. I'm trying. Alright, but yes! We have Unicorn! I have a lot of extra side stuff to do, but I also do want to get started on the on the third theater as well. I'm very interested to see what the next movie is going to be. The only thing I did was mess with um, personas. I didn't have time to actually go do anything else. I just messed with personas. So that's the game plan for today. But other than that, I hope you guys are doing well. <laughs> I'm gonna try to really dish out a lot of streams and a lot of content before and after my vacation to kind of make up for my absence. Um, but yeah, starting on Thursday, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be chilling. I'm gonna be in vacation mode. We do got a lot of tickets. They've kind of been um, they're backlogged a little bit, but it's okay. It's fine. It's totally okay. Whew. All right, so we're doing this one. This special screening concerns the graffiti in the Kama Komashita Man movie. It would seem that one of those drawings has changed drastically. Your orders this time are to find the drawing that is different from the rest. That is all. When you say graffiti, you mean street art, right? Are you saying that there's no there, there's a new one out there somewhere? Yeah. No, Elizabeth said that one of them was changed. That would mean that one of the existing drawings has been overwritten. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Detective Prince. Your detective skills are quite sharp. In any case, I think it will make more sense once you see it for yourselves. That wasn't much of an explanation. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Yusuke's just laughing. Whoa! What's gotten into you, Inari? Well, it goes without saying that this special screening is perfectly suited for me. This is also a splendid opportunity to introduce everyone to the visual wonders of street art. <sighs> hmm, it's true we don't see street art that often. Yeah, you, you'd cause quite a scene if you tried that in Inaba. A quest for street art! I'm absolutely trembling with excitement! But not yet, it's too soon. Be still, my head. Ooh. Oh, brother! Next thing you know, Inari's gonna be opening up- gonna open up a third eye! Either way, allow me to handle this special screening. It's all you, Yusuke. Go for it. Now then, let's be off. off uh, our quest for new inspiration begins. So all we have to do is look for some newly drawn street art. Okay, let's go, Karusuku. Why is she calling me Karusuku? Are we not on a first name basis? I'm offended. I'm offended, Makoto. All right. I don't know why I'm saving. I didn't really, I literally didn't do anything, but uh, whatever, we're here. I think Unicorn has the capability to solo everything. Yeah, for sure. Oh no! Wait. Oh, this is like the introduction to the next movie. Oh, I never did this. Okay. <laughs> A sci-fi movie. So ある日突如個性を生まれてしまう。調和を乱し、自己を主張する自分本位。Oh, we finally, are we finally going to meet P3 
果たして悪に見ようとした一個体は無事に個性を捨て去ることができるのかあなたはその結末に涙する。Delete its individuality. No, we can't do that. Huh? We can't do that. That's a i g i s No. The individuality is what makes a i g i s great. Quite a different atmosphere from the previous film. This one seems to be a sci fi movie, but that trailer left a rather bad aftertaste. <laughs> Being different, different, e b e i n d i f f e r e n t evil, huh? What bullshit? So individuality is an in inexcusable. What's up, Futaba?、Uh, it's nothing. Hey, Kari san, what are your feelings on this movie so far? Well, thanks for streaming some fun content, always fun to watch. Aww. And stream. Also, a k i s pop. You guys are too sweet. Thank you so much, Brad, for the four month resub. I really appreciate it. If it just tried to be the same as everyone else, couldn't it avoid all the trouble? <laughs> huh? Do you really think that, Hikari? <laughs> Everybody has to be the same! Then why do I exist as Teddy instead? Give me your hat. Teddy. How dare you look so cute? No, my hat is mine. Thank you for the 100 bits, Lena. You're great. <laughs> I love this hat too much. It's all mine. Sensei and Yosuke and everyone else are all different. I like each of them for who they are. So it just makes me so sad that they all should be the same instead. <laughs> He's got the right idea. Teddy is Teddy and I'm me, just like it should be. <laughs> Aw. All right, Teddy. That was a moment. That was a moment. It'd just be better if I didn't stick out. I need to act normal and blend in with society. That's what I thought until now. <laughs> and now? Watching all of you in those movies, I started to feel like I have, might have been wrong. But I'm not sure I can't tell anymore. <laughs> Let's get up in that movie! The sooner we change it, the sooner we're out of here. It's time to revise this crappy plot. Right? If we do that, Hikari may not feel so confused about her feelings either. <laughs> Hang on, everyone! There's something you should hear before we jump into the movie. The main robot in that trailer was familiar to me. The same goes for the title, too. What do you mean? The robot with the ribbon looked like a friend of mine. Her name is i g i s You're friends with a robot? You're friends with a robot? I can bet. This is really taking a turn for the strange. Did you two actually just say that? The movie trailer pronounced the title as A I g i s but you pronounced it as i g i s So, the AI part stands for artificial intelligence, but the GIS part. Mm hmm. And my friend's name is spelled the exact same way. I can't imagine that's mere coincidence. It's true that I guess is a robot, but we don't think of her any differently than we do the rest of our friends. She has her own identity and her own opinions, too. We treat her like our companion, not just a robot. A companion with an identity? So, what we've determined thus far is someone we know has been cast into this movie as well. Indeed, first come Ashida Man's world, then Yosuke Saris world. It only makes sense that the same world, the same would occur with this, this third movie, too. Well, maybe third time's a charm, and Yaksi Chan's companions in this, are in this one, too. Oh, you think so? Then let's hurry up and find them. So, you're determined to edit the movie once more. If you sense that there are any in danger, please return here immediately. Of course, we'll be on our way now.、Mm. Theo, your, your guest wishes to reconvene with her companions most earnestly. During, these such,、uh, during times such as these, would you, what, do you, ugh, what do you believe would be the best course to take? We'll just have to wa watch over her, that's all we can do.、Mm. Hmm, then let us focus on observing them closely with popcorn in hand. Sister, could you please focus on either eating or talking and not doing both at the same time?、Mm. Theo is trying so hard. Please come back. Please come back safe. I really want to go into the third theater now, but I have. Ugh, fuck. Good things come to those who wait, right? We gotta be patient. Let's do the special screening. No, Makoto, you're not coming along. Maybe I actually will get to meet the P3 cast today.
I don't know how far in they're gonna be though. Oh, where's my, uh, I need my stylus. Where should we, uh, where should we start? Ugh, where should we start looking for this new street art? I think we've seen graffiti in a number of places already. See, it's there too. Actually, seeing this reminds me. There was a lot more of it here, here, and here. I think there was some in other places too. So oh, I just remembered. I saw some unfinished graffiti in a back alley whenever I was walking around the city by myself. Unfinished? Yeah, if we're looking for graffiti that was changed, wouldn't something like that be, uh, that be easy to overwrite? I see, you have a point. Shall we take a look, Joker? A back alley, huh? Let's move out. You don't tell me how to live my life, I tell you how to live your life. Fucking... Who do these people think they are? Wow, this is going way too well. What's going on? It says, full Karash Kamashita Man on the wall. Ah! Whoa, hey, check it out. Isn't this one different from the others? Yeah, the others say cool, but this one says fool. Fool. Cool and fool, it's only a one letter difference, yet they carry almost opposite meanings. So a graffiti drawing that once praised Kamashita Man has now been changed to deny him. What do you make of this, Joker? People's opinions have changed. Oh. It may look like nothing more than mockery, but I believe it shows that the people are starting to think differently. Hmm? Starting to think differently? <clears throat> Notice how wet the paint is. This was written not too long ago. This is a testament to the fall of Kamishita Man's power. It tells us that people have come to their senses. Slowly but surely, they're beginning to change, just as the movie did. I've no doubt that this street art is just one of those changes. Even if they don't speak out, they have other ways to express their feelings. Art is far more than just something to look at. A person can assert their existence through art, shout with a voice deep inside their soul. <laughs> I thought it was just some annoying scribbles at first, but it's pretty cool if, the mes if that's the message it's trying to send. It means that they're not letting themselves get put pushed around anymore. Yeah, things didn't just end with us beating Kamashita Man. The people actually started thinking for themselves afterwards. Wow, if Fox hadn't explained all that about the graffiti, I never would have realized what it meant. So, in a way, Fox, I guess I'm thankful that you're a weirdo just this once. What do you mean, weirdo? Well, I guess that means that we're fu we fulfilled the request, right? Wait, we did? I think so. Let's head back to the theater. What? I just got here. Did I really just went to the right wall on the first try and then it's done? Okay. I'm I'm a speedrunner, guys. I'm I'm speedrunning. I saw everything from the big screen. You found the graffiti in question without any trouble whatsoever. Admits the work of art was a small glimpse of change. How terribly fascinating. It would seem words are not the only form of expressing oneself. I'm rather impressed by this revelation. Thank you for allowing me to indulge in such a wonderful screening. Allow me to prepare your reward. I'll give it to you in due time. Please, make good use of it. What's up, Inari? Your hand getting out of control again? No, it's just that this latest special screening has given much to think about. Hey? Really? I kind of thought you had it all figured out, Yusuke-kun. I believe defeating Kamashita Man would have some sort of effect on the people's thinking, but I had also believed that the movie would only continue as long as we were changing it. After we left, I assumed time there would stop. Hmm. I was thinking the same thing. Once it was all over, I didn't think it, there'd be any more to it. Bug After seeing that graffiti, I realized that wasn't the case. Even without our influence, the movie will continue to change. Those people have become independent, and now they've started acting on their own will. It's no ordinary film. It's a living entity. Wouldn't you agree? My hand, it's trembling. <laughs> you too haven't touched the art of another. My hand refuses to settle down. No, uh, now that I'm thinking about it, I'm losing control again. I long to give shape to those feelings within me. If I only had a, a brush and a canvas right now. Hey, you might not triggering an Ari like that. Now we're gonna have to wait, wait for him to settle down. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. You got that right. It'll be pretty interesting to see how this movie changes from here on out. 
I won't claim that we're serving justice or anything, but I'm happy if we've given those people a chance to change. And how exciting! I think my hand is starting to shake too! Hi, hi. Alright, enough of that joke. Or we're all going to start acting like Yusuke. Let's just hope that all of the other movies change for the better like this one did. <laughs> Femsi, I love her so much. A new special screening is available. Why are you giving me more? I have so many to do! Holy shit! A story about a passionate battle between men. A violent clash that could split the very earth in two. The rules are simple. Defeat the large muscular shadows. That is all. <laughs> Sounds like fun. I'm getting pumped just thinking about it. <laughs> Hell yeah. Bring them on. It's kanji time. You've got this kanji. <laughs> Looks like you're all set. We'll be counting on you, kanji. <laughs> what? Oi. Hey, wait a sec. Weren't you glaring at Morgana earlier, too? If you've got something to say, just say it. <laughs> hey, Ryuji, cut it out. Kanji Kuni, you too. I got nothing to say. Uh, the hell's his problem? Whatever, let's get going. I'm itching to break something. Those shadows won't know what hit him. Where to? The target enemy's locations are displayed on the ticket. According to this, you'll find them in three separate areas. You may want to mark them on your map. No. Yes. Oh, okay. Or the game just does it for me. Fine. Fine, bring it on! So I bet these shadows are easy peasy. You want to know why they're easy peasy? I bet you know why, chat. It's because we have Unicorn now, and we cannot be defeated by literally anything now. I'm going to show you guys the power of Unicorn. You'll see. Piece of cake, let's go this way. All right, then let's go this way. Huh? Huh? Guys, no fighting. Sorry, everyone. I think kanji a little too excited about this. Kanji, what's wrong? If you're good, I'll give you a banana. Don't treat me like I'm some kind of animal, damn it. No, no, we're sorry, too. Skull gets upset pretty easily. He's like a wild gorilla. The hell? You treat me like an animal too? Stop fighting. <sighs> My bad. It's hard being the boss when you're too you've got two big kids to look after. Thank you for the hundred bits. Unicorn is D way. Doesn't matter which enemy we start with, take your pick and lead the way, Joker. Don't mind if I do. I should try to find loot. Like, they said loot is exclusive to these types of places. But I accidentally keep on, you know, doing shit too fast. Nothing down there. Oh. Unicorn probably could one-shot the Reaper. Don't doubt the Unicorn for a single moment, chat. The moment that you doubt the Reaper is the moment that you all are collectively going to die. As one chat. As one Twitch chat. Wow, how did that happen? Thank you, Akechi. Very cool. Okay. Alright, this is what we're supposed to beat up, right? This bitch is weak to fire. I don't know what my personas have anymore, really. Did I just say personas? I don't know what my characters have anymore. I 
あのシャドウを狙いましたいい攻撃だね Holy shit That was so strong さすがは白金さんかな今総攻撃かけますよこの一撃で決着ですいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいい Only the strong survive. It's a very bare world. I don't know what's going on, but we can't let them keep buttoning heads, can we? We should trust them. You're right. Let's see how things turn out. The enemies are priority right now. I'm just such a kid. On to the next one, Joker. Be sure to check the map. No! Stop telling me how to live my life, Reese. Let's go! Oh, Vemsi, you're so cute. Vemsi, too cute for this world. Let's go! Oh, wait, like we can't do that because. Oh, that sucks. Uh. We can, we can change this up, maybe. Here we go. あいつは任せて。あいつが狙い目だな。行くぞ。この敵なら。かなり実力だな。さすがだね、ジョーカー。I wonder if I accidentally attacked the wrong target. I did. That's whatever. Not that it's that big of a deal. Rush time! I'm so strong. What happened? All of a sudden, I'm just like kicking major ass. You didn't grind that much? I don't think I've grinded yet. Oh no, we grinded for the first boss, but I honestly didn't grind much there either. I just beat like. 10, 15 FOEs. But that was like fun, dude. I enjoyed I enjoyed farming those FOEs a little bit. Tune in! Gotta need gonna need to do a lot better than that if you want to beat us. He's got a lot of spirit. It's almost like having another skull on the team. Huh? I'm nothing like him. Ain't I ain't some thug. <gasps> a delinquent then? Huh? What are you calling a delinquent? He is pretty violent. I can see how people would misjudge him. He really does care about his friends. He gets, he just gets angered a little too easily. <laughs> Shut up! Just, let's just get this crap over with. <laughs> Are you embarrassed? It looks like you two have more in common than we thought, right, Kanji? <laughs> I ain't nothing like him. Let's just drop it and keep moving. Lead the way, Joker. <laughs> I'll floor the next one in no time. Just <laughs> watch. Like hell you will. That's my job. Come on, guys, quit wasting time. At this rate, the shadow's just gonna catch a cold out here in, the sk in his skivvies. Either way, this one will be the last, the last of them. Check the map and keep going. No! Should I look for exclusive loot? Nah. Here. Oh, 
この敵なら僕の力をお見せするよ What is guillotine slice? That's new. Higher damage if the target has an ailment. I should see how much damage it does, though. A whole thirteen. Damn, we a little over leveled. It is indeed a Hulk Hogan shadow. That do be what it is. Another side one done. Come on, who's next? Barely breaking a sweat. Keep them coming. Dude, we're unstoppable. Hell yeah, we are. Let's fight our way through the rest of the. Uh, you guys are still at it. Just accept that you have things in common and work together. We need your strength. I know that. I want to get to know you better. Like, let's talk man to man. I guess I'm sorry for picking on everything you say. Scott is apologizing? Is this a dream? Am I hearing things? Shut up, cat. Can you can't you see I've been worried about you? Wow? The hell was that for? Both of you better stay focused or you're dead meat. Damn. A shadow? Looks like there's another one. It's right on top of us. Kanji, you okay? He did that to protect us. Bastard, get out of here. Let's bring him down, Joker. No one attacks our friends and gets away with it. Kanji protected everybody. What a fucking bro. What a fucking bro. Two Hulk Hogan's. I'm pretty sure I can just rush this. I'm gonna do it. Ooh, MC chose violence. Oh, yeah, Oh god! Nato now has Megado? Game over. We defeated the new challenger. I'm pretty sure that's all of them. Hey Kanji, you alright? No problem here. I'm pretty good at taking a hit. Still, I gotta say, I'm sorry for shoving you guys like that. <laughs> Don't worry about it. We would have been toast if you didn't. That was one hell of a punch. You got some real power. Azaz! Thanks. By the way, let me also just say, uh, I'm sorry. What? Sono... I guess I didn't understand you, Skull. I thought you were just some thug from the city who didn't know how to listen. Mm. That pretty much sums it up. Mm. Yeah, sounds about right. Uyghurra! Shut up! You apologized to me after I tried to pick a fight with you and... You called me your friend. Yeah. We were fighting the shadow. Pretty embarrassing now that I think about it. I'm sorry too. I thought you were like everyone else, judging me and stuff. Those eyes of yours just kind of set me off. Understandable. It's the truth. Yeah, no much, not much we can do there. Kanji's not exactly the most inviting person in the world. Hey, shut it! You two make a great team. <laughs> Maybe we are. We definitely got spirit, that's for sure. Hell yeah, no one's got more spirit than us. <laughs> and thus, a passionate romance was born between two men. Happily ever after! Now come on back. Very cool, Futaba. Very cool. Hey, you're pretty different from how you look, you know that? Look who's talking. 
Maybe I'm just stupid, but I guess you can't really judge a book by its cover. Joker might seem quiet all the time, but he's super reliable when it comes down to it. He's taught our- he's, ta he's taught an outcast like me a whole lot. I'm really grateful for the fan of these, every one of them. <laughs> it's basically the same for me. My team accepted everything about me, even my weaknesses, so I'm trying to get back, or at least help out, you know? Donna? Yeah, it's not like we got the smarts or anything- or the support skills, but... What can I say? I know we're good for something! Hell yeah! You're one passionate dude, Skull! <laughs> All this talk is making me feel like it making me feel more embarrassed. Don't tell anyone about this, yeah? Yeah, no way. Uh, same goes for you. Oi. Are you guys gonna get? You guys are gonna get left behind. Why are you two all red? Oh, did you two confess your love for each other? Hell no, we're coming. Was that a gay moment or a bro moment, or a bro gay <sighs> moment? Both. It was both. A macho enemy and a thrilling brawl! It was a rather sweaty, excuse me, heated screening, and it left me very satisfied. Glad to hear it. Eh? <laughs> yes. I like the response. <laughs> the surprising battle near the climax. My eyes were glued to the screen until the very end, and it looks like a new bond was formed between the two men. <laughs> And that's what we beat the ever-living crap out of the shadow. What do you think? It's a special attack I just thought of. Suga. It's perfect, friggin' amazing. Uh, so first I'll go raw, and then here I wrote it down. We can practice it later. Why don't we give it a name? Something super manly. Good thinking. What about? Yo. Looks like you two are getting along just fine <laughs> now. Why are you so quiet all of a sudden? You've been staring at Morgana a lot lately. I thought it was because you were trying to pick a fight. Uh, no, it's uh, it's not uh, It's not because I don't like him. I mean, yeah, talking cat's pretty weird, but this one, he ain't that bad. Stop calling me a cat. Sono. I was looking at him, but it's just because... Because what? T huh? Cute. Just say it! Just look at how cute it is! How can I not be interested in something that adorable? I wanna see how fluffy he is, how he how his paws feel. I'm all about that shit, damn it. Nah. <laughs> Kanji is so cute. I love him so much. <laughs> Why didn't you just say so? Have at him! Seriously? <laughs> Ryuji, you just can't... I recommend his paws. <laughs> you too? Okay, here I go. Hold still, Mona. I'll be nice. Get back here, Mona! Let me feel how fluffy your chin is! What kind of thief stops when someone tells them to? <laughs> Rip. Rip Morgana. <gasps> the power of bonds. Did you see that? With the power of bonds, Ryunji and Kanji can now use the unison sc skill Skull Bro Bash. Damn. For this next task, you will be required to find what are known as amenities. It has been rumored that these long extinct creatures, uh, what? Have recently been a, a spotted somewhere in Genesic Land. I would very much like to have a playful rendezvous with this Ammonite and its superbly tentacle like legs. Nah. What's Elizabeth. Where's Elizabeth learn about this kind of stuff? <laughs> I have a gift for sensing these sort of things. It is somewhat of a cure for bo. I mean, I'm just naturally talented. We can hear you, you know. Ma, ma. We do seem to benefit from completing these requests. Amon. Amon? Ammonites? Oh, Ammonites. What's up, Inari? Yes. I want to accept this request. Is that fine? Tuskar. What's got you so excited? Mm. I wish to move Amagi-san's heart. By giving her Ammonite? That's nonsense! Girls want things that are shiny and expensive. That's how you do it, but uh, since when were you two a thing? Uh? It's not like that. Yusuke-kun's teaching me how to draw. 
He wants to help me find something I'll like, something I can be passionate about. Amagi-san has no idea of the incredible artistic potential she possesses. I must find this ammonite in order to see what she's truly capable of. This guy's getting all worked up. We better get this done quick. Uh. Yukiko's art wasn't that special, was it? I feel like I've seen the same, same sort of stuff in art class. Let's go. I really want to do the third theater. Maybe after this one, we'll take a break and do the third theater. I'm like getting really eager. I should probably sell my shit. I don't know how much my inventory space I love. I hate it. Half the time, this shit is just not worth it. Oh, God. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I like these side quests though, because it's a way of getting uh, some interesting interactions between the characters outside of the main game, which I do like. Now, Yukiko doesn't need to know how to cook. She just needs to know how to draw. Look, we got our priorities straight here. Yes? We're gonna look for Amonides, but where the hell do we start? I say Amonides, it's, it's Ammonites. Um, they're tentacles, so it's clearly the ocean. That's the idea. Ammonites are sea creatures after all, but there's no ocean anywhere nearby, is there? If we're searching for am ammonites, I imagine it's best to look near water. Fossils are often found in rivers, even today. I believe the closest body of water is just east of here. Tasukaru. Thank you all. Mark my words, I will obtain this ammonite for Amagi-san. I will see her passion in full bloom. I appreciate it, but it's a little embarrassing hearing you scream it out loud like that. Uh, sorry. It's just his way of showing you that he cares. Either way, let's make our way east. Okay. Oh, I re I'm sensing some water close by. Are you guys almost there? Yo, are we really gonna find one of those ammonite things here? They lived in the ocean, didn't they? That's right, supposedly Amonides. I'm ammonites at the bottom of the ocean they live. It's been said that fossils have been found in rivers and lakes that, they, uh, that were once a part of the ocean. We'll be able to dig up the ancient world with our own hands. This will surely arouse my creativity. Uh, uh, is Fox always like this? Pretty much. Uh, uh, Actually, he's not so bad right now. I mean, the other day he wanted to hike Mount Fuji just so he could paint the sunrise. Mm. Yeah, at least we were able to stop him from going up there in just his uniform. Normally he plays it cool, but when he gets like this, there's no telling what he might do. Dude's a real fool for art. He just doesn't know how to hold himself back. What? A foot, you say? I'll have you know I have far better grades than you. That's not what I'm saying! Don't go dissing me like that! <laughs> doesn't know how to hold himself back, huh? Honestly, I'm a little jealous. Yukiko. I've always tried to act proper and live up to everyone's expectations. Maybe it's showing up in my pictures, too. Mm. So that's what it was. Don't worry, Amagi-san. The passion you hold in your heart is real. I will help you bear it all. Now go, expose yourself to the world. Help, please. I'm just kidding. Uh, maybe hold yourself back a little bit. Fox, may I speak with you for a moment? I'm only trying to teach Amagi-san the wonders of art. Aye, aye. Uh, yeah, yeah, tell it to the judge. Mataku. 
Forgetting about the weirdo for now. We're almost there. Keep going. Huh? This is the spot. This... Good. Let the search begin. Um... Doesn't look like there's anything here. Man, let's take a break. My hip's starting to hurt. You sound like an old man, Skull. Let's Shut up! That. Just means I've been working hard. We can't just keep blindly poking around. My paws are getting cold. I think I'll go for a swim. That's your idea of relaxing? Calm down. I think it'd be best if we just take a break. A break? I'm gonna continue looking around. Feel free to take a break if you wish. Whoa, now! There's no need to push yourself. This doesn't even come close to pushing myself. I was once forced to survive on nothing but grass and bean sprouts for three whole days. What, were you stranded on an island or something? Job. Is it alright if I continue looking too? What? You really are excited about this, Yuki-chan! Well, it doesn't look like there's many shadows around, just be careful. Mm. I don't see anything over here. What about you, Fox? I'm afraid it's the same for me. You two should take a break. You're going to tire yourselves out. There doesn't appear to be any Ammonites in the area. We'll have to search elsewhere. Donna? Yeah, but let's have a uh, rest. I'm um, apologies. Uh, man, oh man. My apologies for dragging you all into this. Uh. <laughs> we'll need something in return. No, um, 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 I, we're used to it. Agreed! In fact, it's weird to hear you apologize for it. <laughs> Seems I've made some good friends. Damn right you did. Huh? You say something? Yeah. Nothing. Where do we go from here? Closest body of water is to the northwest. <laughs> All right, then we go to the northwest. <gasps> On second thought, I think I may be too hungry to move. I brought some cookies, so why don't you finally take a break? You too, Yuki Yukiko-chan. Arigata. Oh, okay, thank you. It's settled then. We take a break and then head northwest. We barely have moved. We're not taking a break. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Exclusive loot. I find that most of these are just money. Not rush, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Nice. You wanna adopt Yusuke? Are you sure about that? You gotta make sure you have enough money to do that. Yusuke is a, you know, you'd be an expensive child to have. So, oh, there's a flag. Here we are! Wait, what's the flag then? There's a flag on my map. Okay. I'm sure we'll find one this time. Oh. Right, I'll find an Ammonite no matter what it takes. Dude, I can't find crap. I mean, what the hell even is an Ammonite anyway? Um, it's a creature from outer space. I'm sorry, Kanji. It might look like it, but it's actually not. It's a type of shelled sea creature. More specifically, it's like a squid or an octopus that lives inside a shell. <sighs> squid or octopus? I'm getting hungry just hearing about it. You know, Fox, your attachment to food is really amazing. Mother. I lost my parents when I was young, and as a result, I had a difficult time with money. 
It was a man who once looked after me, but for many reasons I found myself alone once again. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah. No, it's quite all right. Currently, art supplies are my bi biggest expense. Those I cannot do without, even if it were to, me were to mean eating grass again. You sure are passionate. I wouldn't be this way if I were tru truly by myself. Also... I should fix my camera. Here we go. I've had a lot of support from my friends. They saved me and gave me a place to belong. I think I understand now. The reason I can be myself is because I'm surrounded by people who accept me for who I am. That's right, passion or not, I can't do it alone. I don't know how many times I've been fed by the cafe Joker's staying at. I feel like that's a little different. Oh, uh, but if you're short on food, why don't I make you something to say thanks? Nani? Oh, what, are you sure? Hey, you two find anything? Uh, no, not yet. Eto. Perhaps we should change location. Hopefully, Yukiko doesn't do that. Yeah, let's hope. Rise-san said that she sends more water west of Eko? here. Yes. But what about the flag on my map? Hey, wait up, you two! Don't tell me Yukiko's all art crazy now, too! I guess Fox has really, Fox has really ma made an impression on her. Either way, we've got more water to the west. Let's go check it out. It looks like something's buried here. A blank card. Oh! It's just like a prize. Oh. You know what? You know what I'm betting is gonna happen though? What if Yusuke actually likes Yukiko's food? What if Yusuke becomes that one person that Yukiko cooks for and doesn't die? I don't know. Maybe Yusuke has this like special power that can handle poisonous food. Can we actually do shit? Nuclear. He has the cure. I have a feeling he wouldn't die from it. Just saying. And we get power! Not the best, but it's okay. <laughs> Treasure skimmer. Raise amount of found items at treasure spots. I like it. Third time's a charm. We got this. Yeah, let's do it. Could this be? You found one? No, just this strange grass. Is this some type of seaweed? Perhaps I'll try a bite. Aww. 
Dude, no way, that'll wreck your stomach. Seaweed, that would mean... Fox, look at this. More seaweed? <laughs> no, look, it's an actual ammonite. I've never seen a real one before. They really do exist. This must be seawater. It's likely the water here was once part of the ocean before the shape of the land changed. The pattern on its shell, its tentacles. I've never imagined I'd be able to see such an ancient creature up close. I must be lucky. Don't even think about eating it. Why would I eat it? Are you feeling all right, Skull? Uh, yeah, uh, sorry about that. Mission accomplished. Come on back, everyone. Oh. Simply cannot wait to capture this emotion of feeling right now. Mm, me too. I think now I'll be able, I'll finally be able to draw without holding anything back. Well, there you have it. Let's go, Joker. I take it you found the Ammonite? Yeah, we did that. They're a little busy right now. Would you mind giving them a moment? Huh? Busy? I feel as though I am now one with the ancient world. Am I the Ammonite? Or I am the Ammonite! The Ammonite is me! Yes? Absolutely! I know exactly what you mean, Yusuke-kun! Viva Ammonite! Never. Please, let me, let me know when you are finished. Sorry about this. I'm sorry to worry that we've lost the old Yuki-chan for good! <laughs> but aren't you excited to see Yuki, Yukiko-chan's artwork? She's finally... She'll finally be able to let her emotions flow. We'll see how this turns out. I'd say it's not bad. What about you, Amagi-san? <laughs> I drew one, too. It's an explosion. An explosion of imagination! A big bang of art! No, I just followed your advice, Yusuke-kun. You know what it kind of reminded me of? Um, the face reminded me of, uh... Calcifer. From Howl's Moving Castle, a little bit. Kind of gave me those vibes, you know what I'm saying? I just followed your advice, Yusuke-kun. You taught me to let myself go. I'd never done anything like that before, but... I never thought it'd feel this good. That was entirely your doing. I must thank you. <laughs> Drawing isn't simply about skill or knowledge. It's an art born from one's soul, from one's past experience. It is these things that give rise to creativity. I had believed I was to teach you, but it, it, it appears you ended up teaching me. Not at all. My art is nothing compared to yours. If it's okay with you, do you think I could have your picture? If you're going to decorate the inn, if I'm going to decorate the inn, I want something as expressive as this. I'm honored to hear that. I, and may I ask you to give me your picture, Amagi-san? I want to remember the feeling of inspiration I had today. <laughs> of course. Did you two get, a get to draw your pics? Yeah, look. Whoa, that's really something. <laughs> it's definitely unique, but I think it's also kind of beautiful for that reason. You two seem to have really connected. By working together, you can get a double burst of creativity! <gasps> Yusuke-kun! Yes! We may be able to use this in combat! Oh, there they go again! To be on the same wavelength as Anari, she's got some real talent! Arigato. I would like to thank everyone. With this, the Phantom Thieves will now be even more powerful. We're counting on you. Makasero. Oh, that's right. I promised I'd give you something in return. Something in return? <laughs> I was planning to cook something for Yusuke-kun as a way of saying thank you. Hi! Why didn't you say so? I'll help! <laughs> That's probably... A bad idea! Someone's got a croak! <laughs> if you're gonna cook something, we'd like to pitch in as well. I yeah! If, if Yukiko-senpai wants to say thanks, then we'll help too! Your friends are truly wonderful, Amagi-san. <laughs> Yeah, I'll have to work even harder from ever for everyone from here on. Yo, shout outs to to Yuck Narika and Kanji for saving the day. Uh so this is an upgraded version of this. We love upgrades, we love them. Yes, 
So now Yusuke and Yukiko can now have a unison skill. Yay! The time has come! Uh, for what? Ever since you arrived in this world, you've faced one arduous struggle after another. With how far you've come, I believe you may now be strong enough to overcome this new challenge. I speak of none other than the next special screening. This time, you'll be tasked with entering Kamo City and defeating the chicken, FOE. Huh? Oh, you mean that big creep holding the chicken leg? That is correct. No, no. At first, we had no choice but to run away, but we've grown a lot stronger since then. Yeah, we, yeah. Like I didn't already defeat 15 of them, but okay. We can probably handle them now, don't you think? Let's give it a try. I would also like to take part in this special screening. I've been interested in that weapon of his for a while now. Such an intriguing shape. It's almost like a slab of meat. Ah! Oh, I just remembered. I knew I'd seen a huge hunk of meat somewhere, so that's where it was. Huh? Huge hunk of meat? All right, uh, let me take him out. That chicken is mine. Edible art. Hmm, I look forward to it. Sounds like he and Chie plan on eating it. It would certainly seem that way. Wait a minute. It may look like meat at first glance, but there's no guarantee it's edible. Eating is believing! We never we never know unless we try! Agreed. I can suppress neither my passion for art nor my passion for food. Eating is believing? I don't think food works like that, but... um, Right. She. it sounds like they're dead set on eating that thing. Maybe you should say something. It's a meat buffet. Oi. You're in on this too? A buffet! Ooh, I like the sound of that. Let's hurry up and take it down. Man, you guys are really set on doing this. Well, if it's an, it's an FOE me you want, I guess I ought to let it hand. Yo, scary, are you hungry too? I ain't looking to eat. It's just, well, I feel like it's time I start pulling my own weight again, you know? I was separated from everyone for all that time, so I haven't really had a chance to show my stuff. <laughs> Yuck's like, no oh god, oh god. Monstrous appetites, lingering curiosity, and other complex motivations as well. Though your reasons may differ, I, you all are united in your resolve to see this through. However, remember that you will be facing an FOE. I ask that you please remain vigilant to the end. Bitch, you don't even know the half of it. Like, how much I have beaten up these chickens. These chickens are nothing. You have no idea. Achoo! My knee gauge is full, Chie says. Right. Meat and the art of friendship. Right. That's it, the smell of juicy meat! Yes, I too am picking up the faint aroma of meat from the south. I can't smell a damn thing. Don't worry, you're fine. They've just got a freakish sense of smell. I can smell it too, that sweet, sweet smell of cooked beef. I thought that FOE was holding chicken, not beef. Well, chicken or beef, I'm definitely picking up an FOE to the south. Are we close? All right, let's go. Hold on, guys. I'm sensing a bunch of treasure boxes up north. Treasure? Oh, that's right. In special screenings, not only is the area of activity different, but the layout is too. Isn't that right? I guess that also applies to the treasure boxes this time around. So we either take the short path and go straight for the meat, or we take the long way and grab the treasure. I really wanted that meat, but the treasure! The target FOE is to the south, but a mountain of treasure waiting for us if we take the roundabout path north. As always, we leave it to you, Joker. You know where we're going. This is not even a question. We got a thousand yen. Perfect. Let's go, go! <laughs> go, go! Holy shit, this is a lot. 1300 yen. Raise attack for three turns. Item. Holy shit. Chance, 
こいつは火炎に弱いらしい燃やしちまえ弱点はどんどん狙ってこうおお行くぞうしっしんどれどれ Thunder and よしあいつを狙おうさすがはジョーカーだお見事です先輩今だミッケージイズマクシマム。Please do not backseat game. I don't care about damn mechanics in the game. Shut up. Let me just play the game. I don't want your advice or tips. Am I missing the loot? There, there, there's supposed to be. That was a, there was only three hordes of treasure. That's it. At least I can rush these. It's pretty easy, at least. When I'm going to continue the plot whenever I feel like it. Just enjoy the stream! When you put it like that, now I want to avoid it just to spite you. Oh, there is treasure over here. Might as well just get this too while we're here. Cocktail bar? Oh, that sounds so good. <laughs> Level grinding. <laughs> For the rest of the stream, I will now defeat every FOE in existence. That's what you're subject to now. Look, I don't plan my life. I just play video games. I couldn't tell you what I'm gonna do plot. It's a little bit of a silly question. I'm just doing whatever I feel like doing. I can't- I can't tell you more, man. I- I just want to live my life. It's- it, I, I, I hope that's not too much to ask. Haha, -ha, more treasure. It's just a lot of money, but some of the items also seem good too. Haha, -ha, there's the chicken. How fast can we beat up this chicken? You know, now that I'm seeing that meter weapon or whatever it is, uh, whatever it is again, that thing is freaking huge! I knew it. The more I see, the stronger my curiosity and appetite become. Oh man, is that a fried chicken? That could feed like five, no, ten people! Hey, hang on, guys. It's too dangerous to change, just, just charge in there alone. We're here too, so don't go take it all yourselves, all right? You're right. We gotta divide it evenly. I was talking about the meat. I wasn't talking about the meat. I was saying, look, don't take all the glory. You sound pretty pumped, Yosuke Senpai. Yeah, I guess so. All right, let's bring this guy down. Heck yeah. Although, uh, is there like loot behind him that I should be concerned about? Nah, okay. Heck yeah. We get the epic music of epicness. All right, how seriously do I take this? Because at this, at this point, these guys should be like so easy. How ham do we want to go? Megado?
Wait. Okay. Blame. Oh wait, wouldn't this do more damage? I don't know. Guess we should find out which one does more. Oh, got the agility vine. And he hits me for 69. Nice. I'm very confused. Didn't I give myself unicorn? Like my persona that's equipped right now. I should see if we can do this without healing at all. Also, I wasn't going to say it, but the fact that his attack hit both Akechi and Joker for 69 each and no one else. You know the game is trying to say something. I don't make the rules here. <laughs> the chicken ships it. Yes. Even the FOE just senses the gay. Just spewing from these two boys. <laughs> oh my god, a level 6 persona! That's- that's- that's everything I wanted for Christmas. Thank you so much, Chicken Santa. I appreciate it. Meat, meat, meat! Might we be forgetting the real reason we came here? It was to defeat the FOE. No use to find the details, Nato Kun. All's well that ends well. Now, without further ado, let us begin the feast. <laughs> What's this? Thank you for the hundred bits. I am. Personas are Pokemon. This is the same thing. Did you know Persona is a Pokemon? Uh, or no. Pokemon is a Persona ripoff. Yes. It's hard as a rock. Whatever it is, it's definitely not me. What do you mean? It appears to be a realistic imitation. Though it may look like meat on the outside, it's actually made of wood. Oof, that, that's rough. I had a feeling that might be the case, seeing as though the FOE was using it as a weapon. So we can't eat it? Then where did that amazing meat smell come from? I get the feeling it probably came from that nearby hamburger place. Seriously? <laughs> once again, I was prepared for a feast, and once again, you can you tell me I can't eat? How terribly disappointing. Still, it wasn't all for nothing. The construction, the coloring technique, it's barely distinguishable from the real thing. I mustn't forget this. <sighs> oh, there he goes again. Well, if we can't eat it, we can't eat it. I'd say we're done here. Let's head back to the theater for now. Well done, everyone. I have confirmation that the FOE was indeed defeated. However, there is one thing I'm dissatisfied with. I had been restlessly waiting for you to bring back some chicken as a souvenir, and yet you've brought nothing. Yo, yo, yo. My desire for chicken shall remain unfulfilled, leaving these tears of despair to flow forevermore. You're not really crying, are you? Come. Sorry, Elizabeth, it wasn't real chicken. But I get that knowing that you can't eat it probably makes you want it even more. You got that right. Ha ha ha! That was a really good timing. Thank you, little Blazin, for the tier one sub. I really appreciate the support. I hope you enjoy the emotes. The only reason I was trying so hard was because I thought I'd get to dig into the, some fried chicken once we got done. Oh. Agreed. Where fried chicken is the only thing that could possibly fill the void that is now in my stomach. 
Wow, those two really look depressed. Okay, you know what? Once all this is over, I'll treat you guys at Juness. So just hold out until then. Mazi. Really? How much do you plan to treat us? Will this be an all-you-can-eat affair? It's just fried chicken. Eat as much as you want. <laughs> Mind adding some steaks to that? Chicken and beef don't create a good balance. We'll, we'd best include some pork as well. Oi, oi. Don't just start ordering whatever you want. Sheesh, how about creating a good balance for my wallet first? You're really good at looking out for others, aren't you, Yosuke-kun? That's so cool. Oh. Yosuke always keeps an eye on the people he cares about and helps e helps put everyone in a good mood. Although he often does too good of a job and his wallet suffers for it. It's because these guys don't have any self-control. Still, you should take it easy every now and then, Yosuke. Mm -hmm. What do you mean, partner? You don't always have to be the one to depend on. If anything's ever got you down, you can lean on us, too. Is it that, is it that obvious? Nothing gets past you, eh, partner? Sono. You're still bothered by how you got separated from us at Genesic Land, aren't you? I don't know if everyone was trying to avoid touching on it for my sake or not, but I guess I do feel kind of guilty. I just couldn't shake the feeling that I needed to make up for that somehow. Sorry, everyone. You were worried about that, Yosuke? You always get so serious about the weirdest things. Sono. Guess you're softer than you look, Yosuke-senpai. Hey, I'll lay off! I'm sensitive, all right? I think about these things. <laughs> <laughs> but that's one of your strong points, Yosuke-kun. Yeah, Yosuke, if you want someone to lean on, you can always lean on me! Here's Teddy's gotcha! Come lean! Uh, no thanks. You're all sticky from the ice cream. You know, somehow after talking with you guys, all my worries just kind of fade away. You've got good friends. <laughs> I know, right? True, Yosuke-senpai always manages to lighten the mood when he's around. Hmm. I'm starting to see why everyone likes you, Yosuke-kun. I'm glad you made it back to your friends. We couldn't have done it without your help. Thanks for helping us save him. Oh, wait! We're giving out thanks, then let me give mine, too. Thank you! Thanks for coming after me, guys. I'm glad to be here with everyone. Oh, my. We've somehow gone from talk of fake chicken to a touching exchange on the beauty of friendship. Though the matter of the chicken is still quite regrettable. Nevertheless, I suppose the outcome is satisfactory. Okay. Here's your reward. <laughs> Fuck yeah, look at all that experience. So we only have three left. But that's a good place. So we did like an hour of side questing. I might come back to that toward the end of the stream. But I am eager to get into the third theater. Let me sell my shit, sell my soul, basically, same thing. I got army socks! Great! I'm finding that these accessories are just like really not worth it. Alright, so now we go into the third theater. I'm guessing that the P3 cast is in here, finally. 24 hours in the game, no P3 in sight, except for Fem C. Although I do appreciate that they gave her love. And this movie is literally called Igus. Oh, this is great. Oh, okay. I'm excited. Oh, cool. Now that we're actually in here, wow, this is, looks so different from Yasuo Inaba! It's like the entire world is made from CGI. It's also flat and uniform. Money. What's happening? ID verification in process. Verification error. No records found. Registering new models. Huh? Verification? New models? Registering individual ID numbers. Bleh! Assigning serial numbers as identities. That's pretty standard fare for dystopian sci-fi settings. Damn, this place really is just like a sci-fi movie. I mean, that's exactly what it is, but still. It's like techno wonderland. <laughs> sci-fi settings are fun because they have such distinct style. I think I understand how people can get so into them. Are you a film buff? <laughs> Not just sci-fi ones, though. 
I watch all sorts of genres. That sounds surprising. I had imagined Yukiko-san to be more traditional. Well, Yukiko is sort of a bundle of surprises. Yeah. Huh? What's that mean? It means we shouldn't judge people based on their appearances. Mm. Kind of fun thinking about this stuff. Like, what do you people eat? In, what do people in the future eat? <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm totally curious. Do you think I could get, like, some of the kind of s s synthetic beef bowl? The trailer said that this is post-humanity society, so I can't imagine that there's any food to be around. Oh, no food? This world's technology is cutting edge, but it's also more artificial feeling, too. It's rather eerie. A sci-fi world, huh? Aw, you all right, Noir? This place just reminds me of my father's palace. But I'm getting used to it now, thanks for asking. Time to start changing this movie! Which way should we go? I guess we should start by looking for that robot with the red ribbon. Well, we can't just wander around looking for her with... Looking for her with these enemies all over. What are we gonna do? Are you on edge, Anchan? I have a free hand if you'd like to hold it. Back off, bear! You're not pulling up my pa panther on my watch! Oh, all right, we can just hold one of her hands to make it fair. Well, I guess that's fine. No. What? Uh, our heights are way too different. It would hurt my back. <laughs> that's what she's worried about? The height difference? Back to the movie. Are there any uh, objections to searching for that robot with a ribbon first? None here. That robot might most likely holds the key to this particular movie. I want a synthetic beef bowl first. I'm hungry. <laughs> that reminds me, do you know what the standard ingredient is for the manufacturing meat in sci-fi films? Oh, what is it? Now I'm even more curious. Uh, why, uh, why don't we talk about that later? Let's focus on the search for now. <laughs> Keep your guard up, folks. All right, so let me get my handy dandy uh, stylus out. Ah, no doubts here. You bitch, you best not have any doubts. Dude, this place is really cool looking. Uh... Can't go through from this end. Oh, that's what the shortcuts look like? Okay. What are these, like, tunnels? Whoa! Okay, that's a lot of new enemies at once, which is not so great. That, that's, a, that's a lot of new enemies. Oh god. Akechi, <laughs> you ready and willing to talk about Soylent Green? Akechi is ready and willing to say anything that makes him sound smart. That's just what he does. The Akechi way. I'm stunned. This is ass. Oh my god, am I gonna die? Holy shit! What happened? Okay. Ooh, wee. I think I should run. Holy fuck, we've barely made a dent if we're this... Okay, maybe I should try running. I think that's my only option here. Yeah, ow! Everything hurts. Nato got this, though. It's fine. Just some death. Okay, ow! That kind of uh, came out of nowhere. Alright, who has what persona here? 
Oh, Nanto has unicorn. Wait, Nanto shouldn't have unicorn. Max! Ah, uh, me love you long time, Max. Hi. Um, I'm dying. This is a really bad time to watch the stream. I'm like actually dying here. Uh, thank you, Max, for the, uh, 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 for the raid. I, ah, uh, everybody's dead. This ain't okay. Oh, God. Okay, um, a Joker now has Unicorn, which is what we want. Someone needs Fortuna. Ooh, how was your stream? How did you enjoy Final Fantasy XIV today, Max? Every time I tuned in, you were in a different dungeon, so I'm assuming you just had fun with content. I need more healers, man. So we gotta keep High Pixie on somebody. Oh god. This is, uh, interesting. Woo! Okay, no more dying. Everything is fine, guys. Nobody's dying anymore, not on my watch. Okay, we might be dying, but it's okay. No, this is actually... You came in at literally the first time, Max, where we're getting our ass beat. But I've been killing it all day. I say all day, but this is only, uh... We haven't been playing long, and we spent the whole day so far doing side quests. But I did beat up a big chicken, so there's that. There's something here on the ground. Oh, jeez. Oh, an evoker! Oh, ooh. Ooh! Is this a gun? I've seen something like that. I feel like I've seen something exactly like this is like it as well. We just find an evoker on the ground. Maybe meeting the cast soon? Also, hold on. Oh, you did leveling an MGP grind? Oh god, I really need to farm MGP. Hang on, that's an evoker! You mean the thing that you use when summoning a persona? Yeah, see how it says C's engraved on it? Mine's right here with me, so this one could be my companions. Wait, does that mean your friends really are in this movie? Uh, most likely. I can't tell whose evoker this is, though. Well, if this is used for summoning personas, isn't it bad that they don't have th that they don't have this? Maybe they lost it after getting attacked. I hope everyone's okay. Nah. Hey, don't look so down. Remember how our Yosuke turned out to be okay? Well, we'll definitely find your companions too, Yuxi Chan. Of course we will. Ah. We're all on your side here, so feel free to rely on us. <laughs> Not just the Phantom Thieves either. The whole investigation team got your back too. You guys, thank you so much. And you're right, we've got to keep moving for now. Mm. I'm sure your companions are looking for you as well. Let's get you reunited with them. This place looks so cool. A bead. Ooh. <laughs> Holy shit, we're getting so en- Oh my god, this is so bad. We're getting so many enemies that are all different, and it's a really- ugh, We have to find weaknesses, so this takes a lot of time. It's rough when you don't know any weaknesses of new enemies, and then you get this many. Oof. A little rough. Maybe we can get lucky here. Oh, 
here's to hoping that we get lucky. <laughs> oh my god, the miss. Not the time to be missing. Okay, we got a couple weaknesses here. Couple weaknesses. Alright, something, something. <laughs> Oof. Rough. We can Weak to ice, weak to thunder and wind in the back one we barely touched. So. I wanna see... Okay, let's just do this. And... Let's get some side damage going. We still haven't done fire damage on this guy. This is rough, dude. Fucking rough. Oh my god, the power on that. Okay, he did have a power charge, though, so it was boosted. Akechi got deleted. Woo. Woo. It's fine, don't worry about Akechi, guys. He'll be okay. Oh my god. I'm spending so much SP. Not the best thing in the world. Wait a second! Akechi is my only one with Sai. Wait! Fuck! This is bad! Akechi! No! Why did you die? You were so young! Oh wait. Oh shit. Why did I say that? Ah! Instant regret with what I just said. Oh, wait! You have Sai. Oh, sweet. Maybe I just do Megado, but uh, no, uh. Man, this sucks. I still want to find more weaknesses. Holy shit, 6 HP, not even close. Oh. <laughs> Rider? Holy shit. Okay. This is fun. Oh! Oh shit, we got the weakness. Oh hey, now life should be easier. We're just kind of like dead, but you know, it'll be easier now. It's just a little bit of death, guys. Don't worry about it. So we have a curse weakness and a ice weakness. Oh wait, you have recarm. Get on that. Hopefully the recarm goes out before Nato. Fuck. Whatever. Hey, not even close. We just won that with flying colors, chat. No struggle at all. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Not even a problem. This game is easy.
Oh, hey, first shortcut. Maybe we should take that. Okay, I am gonna go back. Oh, wait, we're kind of like at the start point. I could just walk there. Oh, almost made it there. Another new enemy. Mr. Hula Hoopster. Alright, so wind. We'll try Psy. We'll try nuclear. Nice. That's right, I do have bad skills. <laughs> Thank you. I'll take the free hill. I'm trying to find weaknesses. At least we have two of the three, so we just gotta find the weakness of the last of the guy. Oh! <gasps> nice! Got him! Hey, look at that! Easy. Ow. Oh, they're like almost dead. Fuck it. Nice. Oof. Man, I forgot how much I hate new enemies. Holy touch. Isn't that what, uh, medium chance of bind? I catch you gets the good shit. What the fuck? Okay, we're crying in the club. I'm gonna go back real quick. Let's get it. Listen up, everyone. Theodore has made a new kind of popcorn. Oh, popcorn, just hearing the word makes my stomach rumble. I've been waiting, awesome. everyone. I believe I've outdone myself on this latest creation. By all means, please try some. <gasps> what is in that popcorn? Wow, it's so colorful. I don't see food that looks like that every day. It smells amazing, too. Don't mind if I do. What is this? What's wrong? Why'd you freeze up all of a sudden? The moment it greeted my taste buds, I felt a, felt a sort of charged explosion. It was as though I'd been struck by lightning. Could it be poisonous? Spit it out quickly! Is it really that dangerous? Yes, it is indeed dangerous. Dangerously delicious! Oh wow, you're right about it being charged. I could eat this all day. Seriously? This sounds interesting. Let me try some, Theo. Oh, me too! Everyone's trying the new popcorn. Girls are always more adventurous in times like these. Uh, let's try some. <laughs> Us guys need to step it up. Ah, oh. uh, yuck. My apologies, but I've run out of popcorn. Already? That was barely any! I'm truly sorry for the inconvenience. I had some slight a difficulty obtaining the ingredients to produce that flavor. Difficulty. I discovered a d secret deep within the jungle. There, I was able to make use of certain th of a certain something that helped uh, give the final product its charge. Mm. I'm not sure what you're talking about, but it sounds like a lot of work. Well, we've got plenty, so we can split it between everyone when we get back to the lobby. Could I have some as well, Kujikawa-san? Haven't you had some already? Mm. We need to restock the ingredients at some point. Ah, I gotta do another side quest for that. Fuck. We got so many, they're just piling up. Uh, 
何を売っていただけるのでしょう何を購入されますか命は大事にですよおきよチケット売り場寄っていかない I could stop by the box office But now I want to keep going. I've seen an evoker. I want to see the P3 cast before I do any more side quests. Strong readings from beyond that door. <gasps> Just how strong are they? What should we do? I've sensed this kind of reading before. It's similar to when we ran across Yuxi and Narka's team.、Hmm? Does that mean Yuxi san's companions are over there? That might not be all. I'm getting other readings too. That's concerning. Joker, what's your call? Regrouping before we head in there is always an option. Let's go. Let's go. Yes. Time to brace ourselves and get in there. Yeah! Iori, it's headed your way. Keep your guard up. Hey, hey. Ain't no way I'm getting taken down by something like that. Hell yeah, let's go. There they are! The babies! Holy shit! Hang in there, Ken! Aggressive boy. Dog. Kimitachu. Here we go. We're still missing the, the main yuck. Are you guys alright? We'll take care of this. Who are you? Go ahead and retreat out of harm's way. What? What's with this army of masked people? How should I know? Don't worry, they're Persona users too. They're all on our side. Huh? Personas. Time to fight a Wobot. Holy shit! ドレドレ。ヌークウィンドンダーファイル。任せてくれ。冷静に行こう。Sudden pain in my arm. Oh, weird. Oh, my goodness. 
Holy shit! Why is everyone critting? Yeah, I'm good, I'm good. It's like an internal pain in my own brain. No poison. Nah. Oh, the music! I only took care of that. I was so focused on rescuing everyone that I really went overboard on those shadows back there. <laughs> I think I may have gone a bit crazy as well. <laughs> anyway, thanks for that. I'm glad you were reunited with your companions a lot sooner than we expected. <laughs> it's all thanks to you guys. Arigato. I must thank you for helping us back there. We were ambushed in this strange world we found ourselves in. Sid. I feel so much better knowing that you're all safe. I was worried sick about finding you. <laughs> uh, so, are you a student at Gekugan High? Huh? huh? What are you talking about, Junpei? <laughs> How do you know my name? I mean, I suspected that I had quite a few secret fans at school, but to think I'd meet one here in this weird place. Mm -hmm. Huh? <sighs> She's not a fan of yours, Junpei. I only need common sense to know that much. Tsuka. She can wield a persona. Oh, should you be banged? What do you mean? What do you mean you don't remember me? Ah! She can wield a persona. Maybe she is a new addition to the squad that the chairman set up. No, I've been told nothing about such personal change personnel changes. Uh, what what is? Mm. Something feels off here. There seems to be an inconsistency in their recognition of one another. <gasps> She's got a C's armband. Her evoker seems authentic too. <laughs> what the hell's going on? She doesn't seem like an enemy, but uh... what are you guys whispering about? More importantly, where's Igis? Is she not with you? <laughs> you know about Igis? Well, of course I know her. She's our companion. Hmm. I don't mean to sound rude, what with you rescuing us and all, but who exactly are you? Mm. Wait a minute, wait a minute, what is happening here? Nobody recognizes you? Sonna. No way, but I recognize every one of them! Oh. I'm sorry. Uh. I thought she was getting reunited with her companions, but now what is happening? I'm fairly certain we won't get anywhere discussing all of this here. Why don't we talk things over in the movie theater we've been using as our base of operations? So Ever they seem rather exhausted, and I'm starting to get rather hungry. <laughs> oh, whoa, wait a sec. We didn't say anything about going with you people anywhere. <laughs> we're not suspicious. Yeah, we're not suspicious. You're not get, you're, you're just gonna flat out say you're not suspicious while dressed like that? Yeah. Very well, we'll accompany you. See Mitsuru gets it. Senpai. Not only are they Persona users, but they risk their lives to save us. That alone is enough to trust them for now. More importantly, we have no one else to rely on here. She's got a point. There are a lot of unknowns right now, so we need to find out what we can. So what happened to Igis? I guess and our leader got separated from us somewhere along the way. <laughs> Wait, you've got a leader? Oh. Okay, so they have never met. Well, yeah, I mean, not right the second, but is that what you mean? Mm -hmm. uh, no, I mean, like, how can I explain? Hmm. Things look uh, like, th it looks like things are even more complicated than we first thought. <laughs> Imagine having two pro tags in one game, what? All the more reason to return to the movie theater and settle our nerves before talking things over. We can explain what we know about this world on our way to the exit. Uh. I'm sorry for the inconvenience, but we're more than happy to hear you out. We're wholly confused about this. But what a hassle this is. There's a more matter more important than intel that we must also address. We don't have any time to spare. I apologize for being so forward, but please make the details quick for us. Come on, why don't we head back and see what they have to say first? They could be some kind of... There could be some kind of reason for all of this. Mm. There, you're right, sorry. Yeah, I should make sure to talk to them some more when we're back at the theater. Oh. 
Thank God, voiced lines. Thank you. さっきの場所、本当に映画の中だったんだ。我々にはないというのに。まあまあ、イライラしても仕方ないですよ。それに今は行方不明のアイちゃんとリーダーを探さないとですし。ああ、分かっている。それでこの映画館の支配人とやら
やったなお疲れ様行こう<笑>そっかみんなタルタロスから来たんだあ。We don't know where、uh, Mr. Makoto Yak is いつの間にかこっちに来ててえーそちらについては差し出がましいようですがわっびっくりした呼ばれて飛び出てパンパカパンエリザベスとテオのおなーりー相変わらず謎のテンションだなてか誰よこの美人なお姉さんは、uh, We have no clue まあまあこれはおたわらない。私たちは皆様の頼れる協力者。私たちは姉のエリザベス。そして。私たちは姉のエリザベス。そして。私たちは姉のエリザベス。そして。私たちは姉のエリザベス。そして。私たちは姉のエリザベス。そして。私たちは姉のエリザベス。そしリーダーのペルソナを呼び出したりするっていう話には聞いていたがそうかこんな形で会うことになるとはなそれで現状の解説とか新しくいらした皆様とこちらの女性の関係についてです同じ世界から来た身でありながら面識があるのは片側だけこれは双方が違う世界から来た。我々はそう考えておりますえどういうことですか申し訳ございませんが我々には答えかねますですがベルベットルームはお客様の定めと不可分の部屋全く無意味なことは起こりませんあなたがこの世界で皆様と巡り合うええきっと必然ねマーガレット姉上いたんかいこの出会いは意味のあることと存じますええテオがこのシャレオツなかぶり物に導かれたのもまた決まった運命ここれは姉上が着せたのでしょうとてもよく似合っているわよそうねポップコーンだけ姉上思いつかないのでしたら無理にギャグを言う必要はないのではあ,あ We don't need puns. We're good actually. そういう問題あのすみません話を戻してもいいで違う世界から来たのは分かったんですがこの出会いに問題はないんですよねええおそらくはよかった。私たちと一緒にいてもいいってことですよねえいいのいいも何もダメな理由もないし正直君のことはまだわからないがこの状況を考えれば協力体制を取った方がいいだろうオレっちも賛成可愛い子ならなお歓迎ですしこの世界どんな強敵がいるのか楽しみになってきたな。出たな、納金戦闘バカな、誰がバカだシンジはそうやっていつも人のことをあきこそそうやってすぐに人に噛みついてくるだろうが、like uh, but... やめないか、二人とも今はそんな場合じゃないだろう<笑>二人はそんな場合じゃないだろうそれにしてもいたんかいやだちえそれ二回目<笑>これだけペルソナ使いが揃うとなかなか壮観だなシュッ
Yeah, names. Names are names are hard. だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ、だ
I like the, like the, I don't know, the extra stuff that the characters do, right? So they can react to Yukari as Pink Feather Man, and it's cute. It's like a cute touch. ナビがはい。任せてください。他に<笑> イントロダクション。私たち以外にもペルソナ使いがいる。ナビさんとヒカリちゃんはペルソナ使いじゃん。この映画館がおかしくなった時からずっとここにいたの。その発揮したことは覚えてなくて気づいたらここにいて。あの
何せよ今はリーダーとアイギスの救出が先だうんヤクシー is watching the Gekukan High students from a distance おーフェンシーあのあっびっくりしたごめんぼーっとしてて<笑>なになにどうしたの混ざってこいよって難しいかまああいつらが混乱する気持ちもわかるけどさそっちの気持ち考えたらやるせないっつうかつれえよな私全然大丈夫だよパラ We're here for you <笑>ありがとう元気づけてくれてるんだねだって仲間のことあんなに心配してたのにありがとうみんな本当に優しいねでもたとえみんなが私のこと知らなくてもそれだけは変わらないし変えたくないだからアイギスやリーダー探しもバッチリ手伝うつもり強いんだね<笑>そうかな多分みんながいてくれるからだよもし本当に一人きりだったら私ここまで来れなかったはは私も。みんなとここで会えてよーし次も頑張るから見ててね<笑> That's a lot of new members ご無事で何よりですバックチケット売り場は確認しなくて大丈夫ですか Oh god This is, this is awful Immediately getting Risa out of there. <laughs> oh, no hesitation. Oh. oh, God, these parties, man. What are we gonna do? I don't know what to do anymore. Cry right now. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? <laughs> this is not even fair. This isn't fair. No. This game sucks. This game is ass. The OST is gonna make you act unwise. How would it make you act unwise, Max? I feel like it would make you act wise, if you ask me. Oh, this is the worst game in the world. 
Who thought that this many characters in one game was a good idea? And you only have five party members? Who fucking thought this was a good idea? I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I'm just like at a loss. This is a lose-lose situation. Nobody fucking wins. Oh, the other bad part about this is everybody has fucking stupid-ass accessories that they come with. Gotta take care of that. Okay, so, uh, Naoto had this one. Take it off. Uh, okay. Get, get rid of this... Get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, and that, and that. All these useless equipments. Oof. I've returned. What's up? Maria's gone. Oh god, here we go. Alright. Alright, chat. だけんたちのならばい。Perfect. She's mad. Alright. Glad we had that talk. That's a sinner's canopy. I'll be able to summon Amit. A uh, plentiful wheat. Uh, I can summon hair of Eniba. What? I need a Nigi meet him. Oh, the hair of Eniba! It's actually a hair of Eniba. I'm assuming, I guess, it lives in Eniba. And Amit. What interesting designs. <gasps> Regenerate, though. We can make this one. I don't know why I would want to make it. I mean, they're special, so I guess they do something. Gorgon! I guess I can... Hmm. Yeah. We're not using these personas anyway, so it's no big deal. This is kind of stupid, but... It doesn't matter what I do. This isn't going on anyone in particular. Ah. Wabbit season. What are you talking about? Don't hunt down the hair of Inaba. The fuck? That's fucked up.
Okay, so Shinji. First of all, we gotta give this to Miss Fuka. Actually, do I wanna give this to Miss Fuka? Oops, I pressed the wrong button. So, uh, what is... Uh, Futaba's is gone. We just want to level up some persona. I guess it really doesn't matter. Wait, maybe I should... Futaba doesn't got anything. So, what if... Okay, what if we actually do get that persona? We could do that. Let's get the special one. Emmet, let's get it. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing with you, but I I'm getting you. Sure, let's do that. Make your crime, crime juice and it makes you nasty and violent. Max, I never knew this about you. Me eat you whole. Ooh, now we can make succubus. I am never sacrificing unicorn. Holy shit, I'm offended. Fuck succubus, nobody needs succubus. Is everybody on good personas? Like, are we okay here? I think we're good. We're set up with personas. Let's get Shinji, the accessory, and then we gotta sell the other stuff. We gotta change party formation. There's a lot we gotta do because of this new party shit. Um, uh, I want, I want you guys to switch. Okay, I think we've done that, and now we just gotta sell all of our stupid shit that we have. And then get an equipment on Shinji, and we're good. <laughs> Never apologize for going gremlin, it's okay, Max. Never apologize. What <laughs> Maybe I should get another honey popcorn? Okay, weapons. Shinji needs an ogre hammer. Crit rate plus 5%, let's fucking go! And then Shinji also needs some upgraded armor. Maybe. Yes. Alright! We are good to go. Oof! Alright, now that we've gotten all that done, we can officially go back. That was a lot. That was a lot of shit. So now that all the three of the- all three of- all three of- all three games are finally together except for Makoto Yuck, now the interactions can really start and flourish. I'm excited. I'm excited. So, in order to leave this place, we believe we need to revise the contents of the movies shown in these theaters. Do I understand your explanations correctly? Yes, that's what we think so far. Based on the contents of the movie and its trailer, I believe its aim is to paint individuality in a negative light. So what you're saying is that we just have to destroy their shitty way of thinking, right? Also, we need to find our leader in Aigisan. You'll see. I don't get all this going inside movies and whatnot, but it looks like we don't have any time to waste discussing it. I'm really worried about our companions, too. I'm ready to let my fists lead the way. Ugh, 
Look at this guy grinning like a kid. I better not see you go rushing in by yourself. Uh, I don't, I don't... What's the matter, Futaba-chan? <laughs> I have a favor to ask. I want to join you guys on. I want to join you guys on the mission. Huh? You want to come into the movie with us? Uh, yeah. Can I please? That could be helpful. I don't know what to say to that. I get that, but isn't it kind of dangerous for your navigator to do something like that? <laughs> no, no, don't worry. I've infiltrated palaces and mementos with the fan of these in the past. But my plus my hacking skills would be super ha handy in a sci-fi world. I'll do more good in there than out there. Mm. Here than out there. Or there than out here. Fuck. My god. Words. She makes a valid point. Since this movie's world is controlled by electronics, having Futaba with us might would be especially helpful. Mm. What's your call? Personally, I think she'll be fine, but it's up to you. Come with us. Let's go together. Like DMCA. I think that movie is wrong. I want to be the one to change it, no matter what it takes. That's fine. For now, just watch the movie for me, okay? All the way to the end. I'll be watching. Please come back soon. Roger that. Well, we should be on our way. I'm growing more worried about our companions. Be careful, everyone. Please don't do anything reckless. Uh, no problem. We gotta kick. We'll keep. We'll just keep on kicking ass. She wants to check out the sci-fi world. Do you blame her? The Persona users are very dependable. They're so strong. Not to say that I don't believe in them, but I can't help myself from wondering: Will we ever truly be able to leave this place? Do you mean we could be stuck in this movie theater forever? <laughs> I'm merely proposing a hypothetical situation. If it turned out that we must remain here forever, what do you, what do you, what would you do, Hikari-san? I might not be able to do anything about it, but Hikari-san. Do. 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 What are you even? Hikari-san. It's all right, Hikari-san. I'm right here with you. Kanji is motivated. Okay, we gotta go find Makoto Yuck and I guess. I'm really in a sci fi world. Seeing this stuff with my own two eyes, it's such a huge difference. Oh man, this is, a re this is as real as it gets. I get what you mean. <laughs> right? Experiencing something like this in a, is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. No even rarer than that. I can't wait to see all the technology of this world. <laughs> Oracle, you're going you're getting too worked up. Why don't you just relax a bit? Uh, you're the last person I want to hear from that, Amnari. Yes. Okay, time to buckle down and begin our exploration. You're probably more than more than aware already, but I can't fight. And don't you forget it! This is just as dangerous as our usual work with Phantom Thieves. Don't stray too far from the group oracle. You okay? Aye, aye, Captain. Jeez, looking forward to this. It's cute. <laughs> Uh-oh. I have grown motherboard with your resist- Oh, God. Choose now. Conform to system specifications or be eliminated. <laughs> I will not permit you to destroy us. <laughs> Don't worry, I will protect you, no matter the cost. Oh. At least they're together! Animature, thank you so much for the seven month reason. I really appreciate all the support. It's really nice. Yeah, <laughs> Oh God. Okay, enemies. We can take them. Hold on, we gotta appreciate the new music for a sec. Music appreciation stream. Okay, 
やるじゃねえかさすがは新垣君だおい今だ仕掛けるぞ往生しねえさすがは新垣君ださすがですすまないが全力で行かせてもらうぞ任せてくれあいつが狙い目だな絶好調僕の力をお見せするよ Why do they go so hard? Why are all these songs so fucking good? I don't understand. Can you have one song that's like not a complete bop? What the fuck? Chance that. Nedaidu. Oi, or any other thing. You can't. They say Nico. Why is this so good? I don't get it. Like, for real. They really, really do not have to go this hard. Oh god, what's happening? Oh, the door opened. Wait, what? why did you freak out over that? That's not it. It's the door behind us. It suddenly slammed shut. Oh, hey, you're right. I'm getting the, the feeling that there's some kind of pattern to this. You're worried about that too, huh? Well, we should probably keep moving for now at least. But the tiles. I gotta step on the tiles. The door closed on us! It seems that this door works in conjunction with the others. They always uh, open and close with the similar doors elsewhere. Yes. Use our map. Be sure to know which doors are linked, alright? Uh, oh, in that case, wouldn't it be better if we had something for that? Like a new mark for the map. So, yeah. Fox? Oh, I know just the thing. How about this? Uh -huh. Wow, he's insanely good. This would be really useful for the map. Security gate. You're our on-set commander, Joker. Make sure that you draw an accurate map while we traverse this movie. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna do it. Fuck you. Good job, Dad. Good job. Thank you. You know, I genuinely love it whenever they compliment my uh, my map. It makes me feel good. Wait, I should color them. Like, these were... Oh, I, I just realized. Wait. These were yellow gates. And then this one was a purple one. But purple is now the new blue. Did we ever find a weakness for this? Fuck. Not so great. Maybe I should just run from this. It could be really dangerous. よし。行けよ。
Oh, cool, cool. we're fine. Don't worry about it, guys. We're, we're fine. Don't worry, we're fine, guys. Don't don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We're okay. You see, we're totally okay. Akechi is Akechi carried. See, we're fine. Wasn't even close, guys. You see, as long as we have Akechi, we're totally fine. We can't die. I'm telling you, all you need is Akechi. You know, as the resident boyfriend, he will never let the team down. That's just what he does. We should switch stuff around, but um, what we'll do is we'll raise them C. We'll do a little switcheroo. See, look, nothing bad happened. We got like a cool INB blip coin, whatever that is. So we. Okay, there's a few funky things in here, but let's figure out what's going on. So we have these, uh, uh, yellow behind me. Okay, yellow is behind me. I'm assuming yellow is also going to be over here as well. A tropical flower adds new items to the shop when sold. Oh my god! Okay. <laughs> Oh, hey, easier enemies that won't kill us. I'm the only one that can do that, so I should probably do that. High chance to add splash to self-target attack skills for three turns. Oh, okay. Oh, we need ice, don't we? I see what I... Uh, okay. Was that a pun? Wait, what did I say? Did I say a pun? I see. I don't I don't get it. I'm, I'm too dumb. 
やるかよしあいつを狙おう You're talking to a very low IQ person when it comes to puns. I don't get it. Magazero. Yes, I told it all. Book no chicago, Mrs. Rio. Actually, we're going to take a free heal here. They say Nico. That sounds like the smarter thing to do. Oh, There we go. That's what it should have happened the first turn. Ow. That was unnecessary. So, this should be yellow behind me. And this one. Okay. Shortcut. Now what do I do? Oh boy. We're already almost halfway through this place? Wait, that's uh... Okay, this is going by fast, or at least this floor is. I'm gonna heal Joker. Everybody, all the enemies are starting to be a little bit more dodgy than before. It might be because of my level. Oh, like that, dude. The fact that things are missing a lot is really killing me. Ow! <laughs> it's literally killing me. Oh, the power charge. Please kill it. Oh, no! Oh, no. Yuck got stunned. So he doesn't get to do his attack. Ooh. No, we need an all out attack. This is bad. This lowers defense. Maybe I should have done something like that. I didn't really look at Shinji's skills. Hmm. Could have done that. Akechi, get the carry. Go, Akechi, carry! Oh! Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where 
早く手を打たないとね違うなこの敵なら Holy shit 遠慮はしねえ任せろやるよ Oh god I'm just trying Oh god this is this is bad this is bad Akechi please carry us all I should have used the support. I was debating on using the support. I really should have done it. I should have done it. Everything hurts! Ow! Ow! Oh man, I need to recarm. But my SP. You know what? We're completely okay. Don't worry about the SP. Don't worry about it. You know what? We're completely okay. Ain't okay, nothing ever bad happened in this video game. We're gonna be fine. We're fine. What did I say? What did I say? We're completely okay. See, look, things are dying. And then Joker got revived. See, look, all according to plan. See, look, Akechi has refresh. We're totally okay. That's that's gonna help a lot. Uh, I didn't. Okay, I need to start taking these more seriously. It seems. Look at refresh. That's the best ability in the game. Holy shit! Twenty six health per party member. Wow. What is Masakunda again? It is lower attack and evasion for all enemies. Yes. Holy shit, yes. Give me this now. That's a lot of damage. But don't worry, we're fine. See, look. I think uh, there's nothing really wrong with the situation that we're facing right now. I think it's fine. All right, we could pull one of these. We could pull a switch, uh, switch of the persona. Give this to Mr. Yuck. He has the most SP out of everybody here. All right, Mr. Yuck. There you go. Good job. Good job. You're doing it. Um, and to get this back on the home boy, we're fine. You know, this is an easy game. Yeah, we're fine. Front row. Oh, they're all in the front row. That makes it easy. They're really dodgy, though, so I'm really hoping that actually hits all of them. Yeah, yeah. 
Ooh, Masakun does 18 SP. Ooh. A little nasty. Nice crit, Femsi. Jesus. You didn't have to go that hard. I'm not gonna complain. Nice. Okay. We got this. This was this was easier. All right, let's uh, free heal. Um, I could just do this for no reason. Rampage. That sounds like fun. Heal? Yes, we want heals to go off before death. Ow! Nice. Passing the baton. I catch you. You and your bad ideas. <laughs> that was not worth it. Okay. That wasn't worth it in the end. Their speed is too high, these lion wheel enemies. They are speed. Okay. I didn't mark this P spot. I'm loving this place. Oh, oh. <gasps> Shortcut! Oh, 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 we can we can we can go back home. I'm I'm going back home. We're going back. I'm I'm getting the fuck out of here, bro. I am in pain. Life is pain right now. Please make me like weapons or some shit. I need upgrades. Tropic popcorn. What makes popcorn tropical? Like, do you add pineapple on it? Pineapple popcorn? Get 5% more money after battle. That's stupid. Nullifies poison. Jesus. Do you think there's enough null poison on this? Or... Okay. I think it needs another one added on to it. I, I don't know if I'm getting the, the picture enough that it nulls poison. I don't know. I think we need a couple more on there. Okay, that one was worth it. This is just a low chance. I wonder if I should just go for... Haste... Haste just sounds good right now. I'm getting rid of this gold badge. And the null poison too. We're just gonna sell that. Strike guard is good. Maybe, uh, I really don't know what to do here. Maybe I give it to FemC? Yeah. I think that's our best bet. All right, we'll sell all the other shit that we got. 
I think it nulls poison. I don't know. I think they needed to give me another option in there. I think they needed another symbol that said that I was just gonna null poison. I don't know. I don't know if I was getting the hint right or not. Tropic popcorn restores 120 HP. That's dope. Let's also get another revival item. Let's get two of those. We seem to be dying a lot. Um, <laughs> okay, no new weapons and no new armor. All right, we're good, we're good, we're good. I'm good. We gotta save my friends. Mr. Makoto Yuck and Igis are waiting for my ass. God, I'm only level 30. Oh, Chie's motivated. That's really cute. Sorry, Chie. God, I want to use other characters so bad. If only, like, there was a uh, bench experience, it wouldn't be as bad. I would love to change my party members all the time. It's just so punishing to do so. It's, it's just too bad. You can't have a game like this with this many characters and not be giving bench experience. It's bad. Mm. Also, I see an FOE. No bench experience is bad. Yoshi. Like, they just... If they're not in your party, they sit. The only experience that the party members get so far that I've seen is um, from the side quest. So they'll get the side quest experience. That's shared. But... That's not enough. From what I'm seeing, there is zero bench experience. And whenever I look at my characters, like, I think Ryuji is still level 13. From when I left him. Yeah, it does suck. It sucks so much. And the only thing that they give you to, like, compromise so far, this might change later, but so far the only thing we got is, um, growth incense. But why, if those items are so rare, I've only gotten two so far in the game. They seem so rare, why would I use them now? What I would rather do is like get one character to 99 and then use growth incense on everybody and then they're all max level, right? Why would you use that early in game? That just seems really silly. If those items were more readily available, then maybe that would be okay. Just give me more growth incenses. But I imagine even if they did that, it would probably be really expensive. This place is massive. It feels like we've still got a long ways to go too. Tired already? Nah, it's more of a mental thing. Exploring an unfamiliar place like this can get exhausting. But I can definitely keep going. That raises a good point, though. We have a, quite a few members who are new to our process. We shouldn't overdo it. Let's take periodic breaks as we proceed. This would all be pointless if we drove ourselves to exhaustion. Mm. So I've grown curious about your phantom thieves. Does your attire not weigh you down? I've been wondering about that, too. Parts of your costume, like the cape and the spikes, look so heavy, but you move around so quickly. Ooh. Are we really going there? Because I want to know too. What are your, what are the secrets behind your clothes? Um, that's just how they specced. I like that answer. Good answer, Joker. <laughs> if only I had a better explanation for it. I think that's great. Everyone's attire is really stylish and suits them well. <laughs> Our personalities are expressed quite clearly through them. I actually like mine quite a bit. <laughs> uh. We know, we know, Akechi, we know you love it. 
Bro, your mask looks like it does a good job guarding your nose. <laughs> That's true, but wouldn't it poke anyone standing in front of him in the head? That just means it has solid offense and defense. When you consider that, I bet it's even more, even better than gag glasses. <laughs> Thank you for the praise, I guess. <laughs> How about what you guys call each other, like Joker and Mona? Are they, are they nicknames? There are spirit names now. <laughs> Code names? How do I pick the, those? It's mostly based on how our outfits look, look or make us feel. Do you guys want some too? Ooh. Oh yeah! I was just thinking about how time for me to take up my take up a title. So they're like ring names. That doesn't sound half bad. I'll take one too if you don't mind. <laughs> Koro wants one as well. Didn't we already learn where this con this kind of conversation leads us? <laughs> Come on, it'll be fun. I gotta go with the flow. So if we base it off of how Sonata-san looks, maybe Boxer? Isn't that kind of straightforward? The first codename that comes to my mind for him is Protein. That's even more straightforward. Yeah, just go with that. He loves dump damping, dumping protein powder on his rice. Boy. Give me a break. Can you even think of a codename for me that doesn't have to do with Protein, Shinji? Uh. Even if I took the time to think one up, you'd still just go on and on about Protein anyway. Why should I bother? Well, don't make it sound like that's the only thing I talk about. I'm only so particular about protein because it's a primary nutrient that the body needs to... Okay, so Akihiko-senpai is protein. Now, how about Miss Pink from, for Yukari? Huh? I'm getting one too? Oh, that's spot on. It's got that air of authority to it, but it sounds cute too. <laughs> right? Plus her outfits and accessories are overwhelmingly pink. How'd you know that? Oh, right, you already know me. I forgot, sorry. Can Koromaru and, get, and I get codenames too? Amada-kun is a spear wielder, so perhaps Lancer? Is that too plain? If Yukari's Miss Pink, then how about Mr. Black for Ken-kun? Mr. Black, not bad. Even in Featherman, Black is depicted as a cool lone wolf type with a high level of maturity. <laughs> Plus, you're always trying so hard to pay make yourself like black coffee. You even know about- You even know that? <laughs> Pimsy knows everything. Uh... Let's see, for Kormaru, how about Helby summoned from the infernal depths? <laughs> Looks like your names are a little too next level for the dog, Inari. Ja What a name. I don't... <laughs> All right, me next, me next. So what kind of code name do you think fits me best? Geezer. Hmm. Goatee. <gasps> Is that all you see me as? <laughs> it's way too obvious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come now. It's rude to laugh at that, Yukiko-chan. <laughs> you two are having too much fun with this. So For Shinjiro-senpai's code name, how about Brood? Oh! Ah! Huh? Are you saying I'm moody or something? No, it's not that. You take such good care of us, especially Koromaru, so you're sort of like our brood mother. Oh. That's where you're going with that? <laughs> what are you... <laughs> Don't take her side, Koro Ch Koromaru. Koro Chai, he was about to He's trying to hide it so much. Oh, I love Shinji. So the guy loves dogs, but he keeps it a secret, huh? Sugoi. You really know everyone so well, Yuxi chan It's amazing. I know all about you too, Fuka. Let's see, Fuka's code name. Maybe Hacker or Killer Chef. Hmm. Hacker is my deal too. In that case, Killer Chef is the deal for the girls on our team too. Kora! Excuse me! Uh -huh. uh, so the me in your world isn't that great at cooking either. Not great is, isn't quite the idea. It's more like it could result in a murder investigation. Uh. You're way too honest right now. <laughs> oh my god. Uh. But what? Ah! Uh. 
How can I go on? I guess we really are pretty much the same in your world, huh? Oi. All right, everyone. I believe that's enough chatting. We should get going and... Oh, we don't have one for Mitsuru Senpai yet. Got anything, Yaxi? Sig Magnifique? No, that's more on the phrase of a phrase and a code name. Oh, how about Execution Queen? No. Oh, you're right! Mitsuru Senpai does say execute a lot. Please stop this. Anyway, you really do know us well, don't you, Yuxi? Uh, even I'm starting to feel like she's always been a part of our group. <laughs> yeah, I'm surprised too. Everyone here is exactly like the companions that I know. <laughs> Should we give you a code name too, Yuxi? Huh? I mean, I don't really know what it'd be like. It'd be, but we shouldn't leave you out as the only person without one. Nah, nah. You come up with a code name for Yuxi. Um. Spunky. <laughs> True, she's always so bright and cheery. Just being around her lifts our spirits. Really? That's embarrassing. She's like some kind of social goddess. She's so full of energy that it's almost blinding to someone like me. Yare, yare. Good heavens, is everyone satisfied now? Even pl enough playing around. It's time for us to get moving again. Aw, hey? but what about our code names? There's no real reason for us to use code names. In fact, any confusing confusing names could cause problems with issuing commands. I guess that's true. It just feels like a bit of a bummer, though. Arigato. Still, it made me so happy that you wanted to give me a code name too. Thank you. Oh, it wasn't any big deal, but if you like it, uh, you're welcome, I guess. Ikuka. Looks like this was a useful rest for everybody. Well then, let's head out. It was? Uh-oh, that's an FOE sound. Uh, hey, there's some kind of weird robot over there. I'm getting an FOE reading from that robot. Be careful, guys. I see, so that's an FOE. Doesn't at all seem that strong compared to what you guys told us, though. It's just standing there. Not too scary to me. Don't make assumptions based on appearance, Iori. We don't know what it's capable of doing. Hi, hi. I'll be careful. Anyway, let's just avoid the thing and... Oh, everyone, I'm picking up another stronger FOE reading. Gotcha. So where is it, Fuka? It's getting closer. It's just to your left. Please be careful. Left, huh? What the? That thing's terrifying. What the deal is with its hand? Are those for pummeling us? Oh, I'm gonna freak out. That thing is like queen level scary. What do you mean by that? It's not... I'm not that scary, am I? Oi. Hey, now ain't the time for jokes. We don't, if we don't run, we're screwed. Let's find a way past it. Bakata. Let's take the path behind us. Yes. All right, now that we've reached an agreement in our direction, <gasps> run! How about I just go back? I need to step on this square. Now I can be done. For the square! Alright guys, you're safe! The reading of that FOE is gone now! What the hell happened back there? That totally freaked me out! That was rather odd. The large robot pursued us, but the small one didn't even budge. The small one may be performing surveillance. Maybe it sends out orders when it slights an enemy? Wait a sec, you're saying those FOEs are partnered up? It does seem to make sense. If we're discovered by the small FOE, the large FOE will pursue us. That is rather, this is rather troublesome. But think of it the other way. We should be fine as long as we prevent being spotted. Yeah, all right. Although we wouldn't, wouldn't it be even easier if we just beat up the small one? You have a point. I'm not getting a very strong reading from the small one, but mm. let's leave that decision to Joker. However, I will say that it'd be wise to avoid any unnecessary fighting, even more so if we're against F FOEs. Got it. <laughs> Oh god. The gold enemies kill me here. I'm like genuinely not ready for them. I'm running right away. Oh. Gotta get a little bit stronger. Fuck. Fuck. 
行くぞいくぞあいつが狙い目だ。Why? Okay. So we need a sigh and we need a light. Yeah, we will do lots of training. I. The next time I'm. What I'm gonna do this week, as far as like plans for streams, uh, I will be. Every other day,、uh, Q2 and Ace Attorney. So tomorrow will be Ace Attorney stream, Tuesday, Q2. Thursday, or Wednesday, Ace Attorney, and then Thursday I leave. Where was I going with that? Oh,、um, so tomorrow,、uh, or tonight, I will. I'll play a little bit. I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do. Probably beat FOEs, because for some reason I love fucking doing that. I'm crazy. Remedia! Yeah, me too. I'm really excited for the vacation because I get to see my brother. I'm very close with my brother, and、um, he literally, the. What's crazy is that the US,、uh, the Canada US border is opening up on the 9th, literally tomorrow. So、um, we invited my brother to come with us on vacation to Montreal. So he's able to actually come up. And yeah, so that means I'm, I'm excited that my brother is able to come up and, and I get to see him. It's gonna be nice to see family. Let's go! Let's go! So I just defeat this little guy, right? How hard can this be? Yeah, we'll be fine. Don't worry about it. I will do maybe, uh. Wait, I have escape route! I forgot I changed to Fuga! We can flee from battle and teleport to the floor entrance. Oh, I've been running like a pussy, but I have this and I can literally use it! Oh. oh! Weak to wind, are we? Hopefully, this thing doesn't hit too hard. I'm kind of scared. Weak to thunder and wind. The game was kind of implying that I could defeat these. これはチャンスってことだね。Yeah, a k e c h i does always stay. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't get rid of a k e c h i That's like a too big of a dishonor. Okay, it's almost about half dead. What I wanted to do, like my ultimate party, would be all pro tags and a k e c h i A c a t c h y s a pro tag. Oh, oh, so it would basically be like an all wild card party. 
So that's what I want. So whenever we get Mr. Makoto Yuck, Shinji's going, but I want a I want a full wild card party. All right. I'm I'm desperate for it. Yaruka. Hell yeah. Okay, this thing isn't too bad. Easy. God, I can't wait to get higher level spells. I guess doesn't count. Her shit didn't happen yet. Shinji being confused is a little bit concerning, but we'll be okay. Walker. Wait, this is bad because I don't want to win this fight without... Oh god, the thing's like almost dead. Wait, I got a guard. No, no, no. I need Joker to get experience off of this fight. We gotta do something about it. Refresh should get rid of that. Alright, now Shinji's good. Oh god. Oh my god, he did it again. Maybe I should just kill it. Okay, fuck Joker, I think that's what we gotta say. Maybe I actually just use an item. We have three of them. I think... Who's faster? Uh, this isn't gonna work. He's not gonna get up. Oh, power charge. Fuck. It's all good. Turdak? That's new. Whoa! Level 29? That's a new persona I've never heard of. Oh, that didn't give a lot of experience anyway. Oh god! We're dying! Wait! Oh god! No! Yes! It's blinking! It's blinking! It's blinking! Oh Jesus! Oh god! No! Uh, charging! 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 It's okay, we're we're good, we're good. It might be it might be red, but you know we got the orange next to it, which means it's charging. So we're, we're okay. Crisis averted. Jesus Christ! It was doing the blinking red, where you know you're gonna die in like two seconds. Oh God. Mm. We're fine. I really, I really shot a panic there. So that means uh, this FOE won't come near us. Huh? Oh, look! Doesn't that FOE look like it's just sitting around like we've hoped for? Seem this went as planned. Say magnifique. 
Good. Should have went over here first for the treasure. Uh, low chance to nullify nuke and sight. Ooh, you literally forget about your battery life. I, I, I've been keeping a habit of keeping my DS plugged in during streams now because of our debacle that happened last time, where it died in the middle of stream, but... But because I knew I was doing a shorter stream today, like I have to get off very soon here. Um, because I knew about the shorter stream, I I was like, oh, my DS normally lasts six hours. Like if it's on full battery, which it was, it should be it should be good for six hours. So I thought, like you know, I shouldn't. I don't think I need to charge it at all during stream today. Oh boy, I was wrong. Yes, I turn it off. It depends on the 3DS that you have, Ryder. Um, my model is the the latest, the 3DS, the new 3DS XL. Um, which does not have a long battery life. Now it's about four hours it only lasts. But, um, I know I mentioned this before, my longest lasting battery is, is by far my DS Lite that I have. I, I have a DS Lite model. The DS Lite lasts for fucking ever. I, I literally think that battery life lasts 20 hours. It's insane. It depends on the model you have. They all have different, very different uh, battery life. My brother had uh, the first model of three of, of regular DS, and I remember that lasting him a while, at least like a full day, like ten hours. They're all very different, though. Yeah, the chunk. The DS Lite for me lasted so long, though. I don't know why. I barely had to charge that thing. It lasted for fucking ever. Ow. I'll heal, I'll heal, though. Is everything dying? You know what? Ugh, hell. Maybe I should just run. Eh, fuck it. No, we don't run. I have experience to get. Ooh, this is bad. Uh, should I keep doing this? Uh, yeah, I should. I should. I really shouldn't. Ah, fuck. It's whatever. Oh! Okay. FMC get fucked. We're fine. Let's use that. Oh wait, we can't use this the support. Let's not do that. Uh, let's just do a regular escape, see if it works. Akechi, you were the chosen one! We are fine! I hope that FOE isn't standing on a square that I need to step on. I'm a little bit worried about that. Oh, 69%. It's a dead end. 
yeah. I only know like the regular places, you know, just take her to some small ramen shop and you're good. You idiots, girls like places that are romantic. Somewhere like a hill or a lighthouse, a place where you can see the stars and stuff. A hill, we ain't got any. How about a mountain? Neil. Don't be stupid, that's totally overdoing it. I mean, a place where it gets a little cold at night and the two of you are naturally getting closer, you know? Uh, no, not really. Hmm. It looks like they're having a lot of fun over there. Hmm, hills and stars? I wonder what they're talking about. Yeah. You heard all that? We're just trying to see who can come up with the best date plan. You can't just ask somebody what their ideal date would be. I mean, can't you just go where you want to go? Like a gym or something? Don't you think the best place to take a girl for a date is going to be super different from where you want to go? Yeah. Not sure about your hill, Yosuke Senpai. I feel like there'd be a bunch of bugs and shit. Wouldn't it be easier to just ask? No, no. Hey, ramen or a hill? What are you feeling? <laughs> uh, do I only get those two choices? Hmm, it should be about who you go with, not where you go. <laughs> if we're together, Yuki-chan, we can have no fun no matter where we go. And maybe you can finally score with... Burn it all, Konohana Yusakiya. <laughs> Yukiko's ruthless to think she's so ladylike when she's quiet. Speaking of ladies, Noir is quite a lady herself. I mean, she's the Har Harris to a huge-ass company. <laughs> I'm no different from anyone else. That elegance, that noble aura, that's like your thing. Yeah, the way you carry yourself is always so beautiful. Arigato. Thank you. My parents were really strict about things like that, so I suppose it's a just na second nature at this point. But you're as just as lovely, Yukiko-chan. You're graceful and your mannerisms are just so majestic. Yeah. Uh, thank you. I'm just doing what I was taught. Sokka. So it's the same for you too. Shikashi. That may be true, but when Noir fights, she's the epitome of the word bold. And that unpredictability only enhances her elegance. Both ladies are refined, but within them lies passionate hearts. Perhaps they have something in common. So, ramen or a hill? Hmm, we're still talking about this? It's kind of pointless, don't you think? Yeah, incredibly pointless. <laughs> uh, I thought so. Man, those two would make one hell of a team. We always knew that Yukiko and Haru, the quiet, silent, deadly types. I always knew they'd get along. They're like two peas in a pod, really. What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Ramen or a hill? Ramen, ramen. Why can't you, like, take ramen to go and take it on a hill? That's what my vote would be. Like a, like a picnic? Ramen to go from somewhere and then you take it and you have a picnic? On a hill? That's my vote. Cause not gonna lie, I do enjoy picnics as a good date. I find them romantic and nice. And Dom... <sighs> you know, I'm all about the, the classic... I'm all about the classic... Uh... Wait, what am I doing? Fuck, I need to do two things at the same time and I'm really bad at it. I like having the classic, you know, the blanket on the, on the ground. And I can't convince Dom for the life of me to buy a fucking nice picnic basket. He doesn't want He's like... Why would we want it? Why do you want a picnic basket? It's for like that one time that we go on a picnic. Like, <laughs> I'm just like, Tom, I just want to have a romantic date on a, having a picnic with a blanket and a nice basket. <laughs> ah! I'm crying in the club. I'm crying in the club. You know, it's hard. It's hard when, it's hard when your partner doesn't want a picnic basket. What do you do? What do you do? I'm like, I want the basket. I think the basket is an essential part of a picnic. You know? He disagrees. He thinks it's about, you know, you can just, he, you can just get a, get a grocery bag, put all your food in there, and, but like, no, not a grocery bag. It's a picnic. 
You need a basket. I'm saying. You buy it for him? I, you know, one of these days I will. I will just buy it and he'll have to deal. I'm, I'll be like, Dawn, we're going on a picnic now. We're going on a picnic right now. And we're going to use this basket. And we're going to make cute sandwiches. Yeah. We're at dead end. What are we gonna do? Mm. The gate that alternates between opening and close is just up ahead. Let's leave the FOE there. That's a great idea. If we have the pursuing FOE go through the gate, the currently closed door will open for us. Is that your plan? Yes. I can definitely see that working. Let's give it a try. But it's closed right now. Wait. Oh, he's gonna step through that. Oh, I see. Crust or no crust? Hmm. I'm I don't like crust, sorry. I know. I know I'm like more of the unpopular, but me and crust just don't I don't I don't I don't get along with crusts. Don't don't call me out, okay? Don't cancel me over it, please. It's just, it's just not my preferred taste, chat, you know? I'm not... Uh, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm very sorry about it. I don't, I don't want to hurt anybody's feelings. But me and the Crust Gang just... Just don't get along. I have to go in, like, literally five minutes. I can't keep going. You know, we're gonna speed run. I'm gonna run from everything right now. Like, if you give me a sandwich that has crust on it, of course I'm gonna eat it. I'm not gonna deny it, and I'm also not one of those weird people that'll pick off the crust. Like, if you give me a crust sandwich, like, I'm gonna eat it. But my preference is no crust. It's just a preference. Not that I will just outright refuse. I'm not that much of a dick. So we have to beat up this guy, huh? How about pizza crust? Again, it's the same thing. I'm not a pizza crust person. Uh, what I like to do, because I don't like wasting food either, so in order for me to eat the crust, I'll like, I'll eat the whole pizza and then I'll leave the crust for later. If I have like three slices, I'll leave it for later. And then I'll dip the crust in, like, a ranch dressing at the end. Just so it's, like, not just crust. So I have my crust with ranch. Stuffed crust is the shit. I do love stuffed crust. As long as there's something to it, but like crust, it's just bread, man. Just crunchy bread, and I don't like it. But I think it's more of a like a texture thing. Like I don't. I, it, typically with foods, I don't like crunchy textures in general, and that you know that carries over to a lot of different kind of foods. I feel like that if you're a person that like crust. I feel like you're also the same kind of person that likes crispy bacon, for example. Like, I like wimpy, chewy bacon, not crispy. It's the same thing. Like, I, I like the I like the soft category rather than, like, the, the crunchy hard category. I can't think of very many exceptions. There might be an exception yeah. here and there, but, but generally, yeah. That That's where I'm at. I'm sorry for, for those that are on the opposing side. You don't like cheese texture? Cheese? Like a block of cheese? Uh, wait, that's a new one. 
<laughs> whenever you say you don't like cake. I wouldn't crucify you for saying that you don't like cake, but there, the thing is that's such a broad term. There's so many different kinds of cake. You can't say that you don't like all kinds of cake. There's so much. There's too much different kinds. Have you ever had um one of my uh, guilty pleasures that I don't get to have a lot uh, that I would love to have more is uh, uh Japanese cheesecake. I love Japanese cheesecake. It's so good because. It's so uh, light. It's it's a it's a very light feeling of dessert. I don't have it enough. I'm only ever able to get it at like the the famous. There's like a famous Japanese cheesecake place in Montreal. That's the only place where I'm able to get it, and it's so good. It's so fucking good. And then there's ice cream cake. I cannot live my life without ice cream cake. It's just so good. I can't. I'd like ice cream cake is my life and my love. See, there's like so many different kinds of cake, you know? How do you like... not like the whole category? I don't know, there's so many different kinds. Cheesecake does not taste like cheese, no. I mean, to me it doesn't, I'm sure, like... Maybe it does for some people, but for me, I never taste the cheese outright. Like, it's not like this stick-out ingredient. Ice cream cake, it's the superior cake. Thank you. It is. It absolutely is. I need to get out of this battle, like, now. I actually have to go. You like birthday cakes? That's the kind I don't like at all. Oh, you don't you like the regular cakes or uh, ice cream cake? I mean, birthday cakes is whatever. I, I do like the classic, like, chocolate regular birthday cake, but, like, if we're having birthday cakes, I want it to be ice cream. What my family always used to have tradition wise, um, we always used to, have, for all of my immediate family's birthday, my brother, sister, mom, and dad, uh, we would always buy ice cream cakes for everybody's birthday. So we had birth we had five ice cream cakes per year, and it's the shit. I can't imagine my life without birthday cakes. I mean, sorry, without ice cream cakes. I'm spoiled. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. He should be dead, though. There we go. Got him. Oh, we actually got Succubus! I didn't have to sacrifice Unicorn for her. I had a really good Oreo cheesecake at a restaurant, like, two weeks ago. Oh, Oreo cheesecake. Oh. I think I just... I, I don't think I can live lives anymore without this, these kinds of things. <laughs> Honestly, if chat wasn't chill about the hot takes, you'd be banned. People are allowed to have opinions, you know? Am I gonna die? Please don't die. Oh, nice. Why is everyone failing to escape? What is your fucking... Oh my god. Fucking hell. I'm just trying to get to the stairs here. That's all I'm trying to do, is just get to the stairs. I gotta go.
I'm not a fan of mint chocolate. I'm sorry. Yes. There's no sign of Igus or our leader. Where could they have gone? Same goes for the robot that looks like Igus, and she's supposed to be the key to changing this movie. You guys have been searching all over here when we ran into you, yeah? Uh. That's correct. However, our findings were extremely limited. There were there were mechanisms and obstacles everywhere. When we had reached our wit's end by the time we met you. Let's be careful. Uh, let's just keep moving. Yeah. If they were at our at their wit's end, they would ought to think that they would ought to think things through here rather than blindly charge ahead. If only we could get some useful information from someone. But who? We've only met robots so far in this movie. Take off. <laughs> Trying to. I catch you, God. Uh, let me just make this crystal clear. No seeking intel from the large dog-shaped robots. Got it? It'd be- it'd be better to find- uh, best to find an unarmed intel source that they won't attack us. What could we- where could we find a robot to speak with? Well, I guess. Oh, look over there! It's a weak-looking robot all by itself! Oh, you're right. I'll attempt to question it. Nah. Queen, are you sure? Won't it just get all suspicious right away, like with, from that cop from before? <laughs> I'll do better this time. Please be careful. We'll be watching from here. Ano? Excuse me, there's something I'd like to ask you. Break is at 1500. <laughs> Today's production rate is currently 80%, 2% decrease from yesterday's average. <laughs> That's not what I wanted to ask about. Five cases of error connection, 21 cases of scrap treatment. It's no good, I can't communicate. It certainly seems that way. I believe we'd be only wasting time trying to speak to this robot any longer. This isn't anything like how it went with Igus. Huh? Hey guys, what do you think that's on the, uh, what's on the LCD screen? Mm. Seems to be an order demanding an increase in the robot's production rate. Who could get the- who could that be on there? It says, Great Overseer. <laughs> Wait a second, I feel like I've seen that long hair and pair of glasses before. No matter how you look at it, it's- it- that's definitely a Kutsuki. Oh, yeah? Is that someone you know? He's a- no. <laughs> Please, no. Uh... He's the chairman of the board at Gekkon High and the club advisor of C's. <laughs> but why is our chairman the overseer of a robot world in this movie? Fukasan, maybe put him? But I've never heard anything of the sort. Make the most sense to consider this another example of the movie's casting. <laughs> Individuals somehow tied to all of us and people in the theater world have appeared as characters in the movies. Theater 1 was Kamashita Man, Theater 2 was Yosuke Soros. Take a look, closer look at the image. Doesn't it look more like something created with CGI rather than a real person? Now that I think about it, the chairman does wear glasses, but not sunglasses like those. Sorry. We're saying that robot lo that looks like Igus from the trailer, that's part of this casting too? Most likely, but the, in the movie we had appeared with, Yosuke had been cast as a dinosaur, but with his own head. It looked less like a casting and more like a bizarre collage to me, but I really lost it the first time I saw him. The chairman is sort of like a guardian to us. If you take that into consideration, he's, his casting as the overseer here isn't all that strange. Would this fake Akutsuki-san know where our leader and Igus are? Yeah. They may look similar, but their actual identities are completely different. Don't bank on him being on our side. Take off. Oh yeah, this guy's a big cheese around here. Doesn't that mean he's the one giving those orders to eliminate individuality and all that shit? <laughs> He'd have to be pretty messed up in the head to do something like that, so what are we gonna do about it? Hmm. If he's supervising the robots that have been uh, that have some kind of fa facility like a security complex or a control center, then why don't we try looking for a place like that? It sounds better than just wandering around and getting lost. So where could the facility be? If there's a management facility, I'd think I'd imagine it's some sort of central hub, possibly the innermost part of the city. I'm almost done. Joker, should we try to look for the facility in the central part of the city? Sounds like a plan. I gotta go. Ah, uh, shut up, Teddy. Don't go running off like that. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. What's up, Mitsuru? Yeah. I was just thinking about Pancake. She even knew about the chairman. She, just who could she be? Hmm. Uh, well, she doesn't seem to be flying. Uh, she's trying to act brave, though. Uh, probably out of consideration for us. Uh, yes, and I do feel awful about that. However, we are having an inkling of who she is. Uh, it's only during these times like these that I'm envious of Akiko's impulsiveness. Uh, why are you sh are you shitting me? I don't really know anymore. Oh, no. Is something the matter? If we don't keep moving, we'll get separated from the others. Yeah. It's not uh. that we're off now. Indeed. Okay. Okay. You can see that tiny, tiny screen. I know, that's what I have to use. Like, the screen gets a better view than I do. 
Yeah. Whoop. You could just read your yes. <laughs> I thought about it, but yeah. He's 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 seeing my setup right now. Lena sent me a clip. Of the, sent you a clip? Yeah, of the, the, the picnic basket thing. Oh yeah! <laughs> Tell them how much you don't want me to get a picnic basket. He thinks it'd be a waste. Tell him. No. You're making me the villain. Yeah, I am. No. You don't want a picnic basket. You are the villain. I just feel like it's funny because you want like this super classic like like straw picnic basket. <gasps> yes. With, the, with like the this checkered. Blanket no, I don't need the checkered blanket. I just need a basket. I don't request a checkered blanket. While every other Canadian have like this super handy like sports backpack with a cooler and everything. I want a basket! Okay, let's get you a damn basket then. You're not gonna be happy about it. I want a basket! That's romantic! A backpack... A, am I wrong? Like, a backpack is not romantic. A basket is romantic. But how do you carry that, like, when you go biking? Because that, that's how we go lunch somewhere. We, we go bike somewhere. That's why you have a backpack. How do you carry that, that straw basket? You're over... You're overthinking it. Oh. You're overthinking it. Yeah. Yes. Oh, okay, then. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting a basket one day. Ryder says I'm right. Ryder! <laughs> you don't have taste! What's happening? I'm sure there's a lot of Montrealers or Quebecers. In I know oh God, my hair is a lost cause. I we need to go! <laughs> <laughs> Your is cute. Okay, but majority rules, I should get a basket. Yeah, I mean, if you want a basket, let's get a basket. Yeah, that's right, and it's not a it's, waste of room in our it's apartment. It's just fun to make fun of. <laughs> Baskets are romantic! Backpacks are not. My case in point. Okay. Yes. You can maybe get to that point. Well, it's the equivalent of, like... Uh, like, if you have a centerpiece of like flowers or a candle on your dinner table, that's romantic, right? But if you have a a centerpiece of of a, a of a ski pole, that's not very romantic. Yeah, but what if it's like so much flowers that you can't even see your partner? Like, no, you just get like, like a nice little flower or a little like a little thing. You don't get the big big flowers on your center table. Yeah, but like you're kind of over. No, I'm just making a comparison of romanticism, not the size of the- Ugh. God damn it. <laughs> just trying to make a point. I'm trying to make an analogy. Is it more romantic or is it more tacky? Which one is the highest? Wait, wait, what's tacky? Are you calling the basket tacky? No. Are you calling the basket tacky? No. <laughs> we should get going, huh? Yeah. I think I've saved like five times. Wait, there's a pole? No! <laughs> Basket backpack. Okay, you... chat. Okay, basket's winning. I mean, of course they'll support you. No, they would support you. I don't think Chad has any problem going against me. I'm just making the better arguments here. But what is the poll anyway? Basket or backpack? <laughs> yeah, basket or backpack for what's more romantic. Oh, for a picnic. For what you would rather have at a picnic, a basket or a backpack. Well, we'll be sure to take some pictures of us with our tacky basket. <laughs> no! I'll show you back! The baskets can be really cute and not tacky! They're super cute! And I'll get you that little checkered, <laughs> that checkered uh, red and black. I don't need blanket. the checkered red and red and uh, white. It red and white. And, and you fill it with like cute apples. No, I don't need that. I just want the basket. Okay, we really have to go.
go. It's about the aesthetic. <laughs> yes, aesthetic is romantic. I'm more about the practical side of it. But that's okay. Yeah, and most times I am practical, but if in a romantic setting, fuck practicality. Okay. Yeah. That's a good point. I'll show you. Okay, anyway, thank you, Chad. <laughs> thank you for taking part in this heated debate at the end of stream, but we really do gotta go. Thank you guys for hanging out tomorrow.